mock you viciously Through music we captivate Through songs and words we propagate We'll mock and smear and slander Infiltration, propaganda After years is finally resolution It's time to start the revolution We're done! We will rise like the sun and we'll never run And we will fight, fight till we won We will bite, we will smite all through the night We'll never sleep, never rest Put the faith to the test, the self-obsessed Self-confessed, self-professed Divinity, nobility Your God is a fraud, so stop We're done With the violence and the fury and the cruelty Said we're done, we will win the war, we'll win the fight, the end's inside. All you see in us is barbarian, but all we want is to be equalitarian. We will rock, we will never stop, standing on the top of the hilltop, and we will mock, viciously, capriciously. We're tired of assault and the bigotry You seem so full of wit and chivalry But when we knock at your door, you'll break We're done We have fire in our veins And we will break these chains We're done We won't be ripped apart You will be burning battles Tired of salt and bigotry, we'll stand and mock you viciously. Through music we captivate, through songs and words we propagate. We'll mock and smear and slander, infiltration, propaganda. After years is finally resolution, it's time to start the revolution. We're done! We will rise like the sun and we'll never run And we will fight, fight till we won We will bite, we will smite all through the night We'll never sleep, never rest Put the faith to the test, the self-obsessed Self-confessed, self-professed Divinity, nobility Your God is a fraud, so stop We're done With the violence and the fury and the cruelty Said we're done. We will win the war. We'll win the fight. The end's in sight. All you see in us is barbarian, but all we want is to be equalitarian. We will rock. We will never stop. Standing on the top of the hilltop, and we will mock viciously, capriciously. We're tired of assault and the bigotry You seem so full of wit and chivalry But when we knock at your door, you'll break We're done We have fire in our veins And we will break these chains We're done We won't be ripped apart You will be burning battles Tired of salt and bigotry, we'll stand and mock you viciously.
maliciously Through music we captivate Through songs and words we propagate We'll mock and smear and slander Infiltration, propaganda After years is finally resolution It's time to start the revolution We're done! We will rise like the sun and we'll never run And we will fight, fight till we won We will bite, we will smite all through the night We'll never sleep, never rest Put the faith to the test, the self-obsessed Self-confessed, self-professed Divinity, nobility Your God is a fraud, so stop We're done With the violence and the fury and the cruelty Said we're done. We will win the war. We'll win the fight. The end's inside. All you see in us is barbarian. But all we want is to be equalitarian. We will rock. We will never stop. Standing on the top of the hilltop, and we will mock viciously, capriciously. We're tired of assault and the bigotry. You seem so full of wit and chivalry. But when we knock at your door, you'll break. We're done. We have fire in our veins and we will break these chains. We're done. We won't be ripped apart. You will be burdened by the sky. We're tired of salt and bigotry We will stand and mock you viciously Through music we captivate Through songs and words we propagate We'll mock and smear and slander Infiltration, propaganda After years is finally resolution It's time to start the revolution We're done! We will rise like the sun and we'll never run And we will fight, fight till we won We will bite, we will smite all through the night We'll never sleep, never rest Put the faith to the test, the self-obsessed Self-confessed, self-professed Divinity, nobility Your God is a fraud, so stop We're done With the violence and the fury and the cruelty Said we're done. We will win the war. We'll win the fight. The end's in sight. All you see in us is barbarian. But all we want is to be equalitarian. We will rock. We will never stop. Standing on the top of the hilltop. And we will mock. Viciously. Capriciously. We're tired of assault and the bigotry. You seem so full of wit and chivalry. But when we knock at your door, you'll break. We're done. We have fire in our veins and we will break these chains. We're done. We won't be ripped apart. You will be burdened by the sky. We're tired of salt 
and bigotry We'll stand and mock you viciously Through music we captivate Through songs and words we propagate We'll mock and smear and slander Infiltration, propaganda After years is finally resolution It's time to start the revolution We're done! We will rise like the sun and we'll never run And we will fight, fight till we won We will bite, we will smite all through the night We'll never sleep, never rest Put the faith to the test, the self-obsessed Self-confessed, self-professed Divinity, nobility Your God is a fraud, so stop We're done With the violence and the fury is barbarian but all we want is to be equalitarian and we will rock we will never stop standing on the top of the hilltop and we will mock viciously capriciously we're tired of assault and the bigotry you seem so full of wit and chivalry but when we knock at your door you'll break we're done we have fire in our veins and we will break these chains we're done We won't be ripped apart You will be burned and battle-scarred We're tired of salt and bigotry We'll stand and mock you viciously Through music we captivate Through songs and words we propagate We'll mock and smear and slander Infiltration, propaganda After years is finally resolution It's time to start the revolution We're done We will rise like the sun and we'll never run And we will fight, fight till we won We will bite, we will smite all through the night We'll never sleep, never rest Put the faith to the test, the self-obsessed Self-confessed, self-professed Divinity, nobility Your God is a fraud, so stop We're done With the violence and the fury and the cruelty Said we're done. We will win the war. We'll win the fight. The end's inside. All you see in us is barbarian. Well, all we want is to be equalitarian. And we will rock. We will never stop. Standing on the top of the hilltop, and we will mock viciously, capriciously. We're tired of assault and the bigotry You seem so full of wit and chivalry But when we knock at your door, you'll break We're done We have fire in our veins And we will break these chains We're done We won't be ripped apart You will be burned and battle-scarred We're tired of and bigotry, we'll stand and mock you viciously through music. 
We captivate with songs and words we propagate. We'll mock and smear and slander. Infiltration, propaganda. After years is finally resolution. It's time to start the revolution. We're done. We will rise like the sun and we'll never run And we will fight, fight till we won We will bite, we will smite all through the night We'll never sleep, never rest Put the faith to the test, the self-obsessed Self-confessed, self-professed Divinity, nobility Your God is a fraud, so stop We're done With the violence and the fury and the cruelty Hello Welcome back to Fumble Folks, our long form campaign here at the Rapid Riders. My name is Rubber Sam. Uh, I am your dungeon master. And with me, as always, are all of my Rapid Riders this time. Uh, plus one. Hi, hello. <laughs> yeah, plus this guy. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, whoever this guy is. Yeah. Um, but I will let them all introduce themselves at the same order as normal. Great. Can you start with somebody else for a sec? Yes, of course I can. Uh, in go. each case, uh, reintroducing themselves, uh, we call Ben. Uh, hi there, I'm Ben. I play Zeke Boondiggles, the half gnome, half dwarf, half monk, half warlock. It's been a little while of a while since I've said that. Um, currently, a sleepy boy, apparently, face down on a desk, doing something that he hasn't done in quite a while, and picking up a quill. Sleep. <laughs> Also that. <laughs> <laughs> Tends not to sleep, does he? He tries. Whenever he try get, wants to sleep, people wake him up. And when, whenever he, he should sleep, things happen that makes him want to stare at people. <laughs> yeah. He's a paranoid little boy. He's our paranoid little boy. <laughs> um, also here is Doran. Hello, I am Doran. I play everyone's favourite, newly, everyone's favourite, to hate, human <laughs> noble. <laughs> um, he Do is either. a human, he is a noble. That is, that is it. <laughs> He's a prisoner. What's her name? Know, no. What's her name? His name is Halbertiri. Thank cool. you. Yeah, I, I, I have a whole thing in my head planned out and just... I haven't put your name Probably. on there yet, so apologies. That <laughs> it's only is been fine. Two weeks. <laughs> I don't deserve one. <laughs> no, if we don't kill you, then you'll get your name yeah. on the board. Okay. <laughs> <There's> criteria. <laughs> um, kill me. little tiny glow. <laughs> Seb. <laughs> Fuck, I hate this guy. <laughs> I've got to change my intro this time. So, hi, I'm Seb. Was once the only real good group. Was also once the only human of the character of the group, but now <laughs> we're the guy's wow. monk of the group. <laughs> You're just sharing everything with everybody else. Absolutely. Lol. <laughs> That's so Sharing. Gay can. Uh, she is quite happy. She won the chess game. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. <clears throat> um. <laughs> Phil. Hello. I'm a Phil, um, and I am playing Dunstan Dewey Fairfoot. He is a little part halfling, part dew elf. Uh, he's a ranger, and he is a child in what pro should probably be classed as an adult's body, but he's too wholesome for this world. Um, he is uh, a ranger uh, with a little bit of scout rogue thrown in for for flavour. Um <laughs> Yeah, uh, and is a swarm keeper as well. So he has a host of birds that he's been reunited with. He is learning that it's not 
they're not actual they might not actually be actual birds he's not really sure because other creatures helped him in during the hellscape of the mines and the shadow roads that they have just emerged from um, but now he's happy to have his pigeon friends back who wouldn't be <laughs> who would be indeed um, and last but not least Bree hello <laughs> I am Bree I play Diana uh, she's a sun elf, bard of eloquence, and divination wizard. Yay! Um, and currently, um, I don't know, she's thirsty. How about that? That's all. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of salt water. That's I know, cool right? Thing. Maybe that's a why she's so water, thirsty. Not a lot of drink. Oh, boy! <laughs> ah! Ah! <laughs> okay. <laughs> Well, go, go for Sam. <laughs> the <laughs> Rapid Riders uh, are travelling aboard the ship of their companion in this rebellion, um, the Captain Blake, uh, aboard the Rake, their ship, uh, with their crew. Um, they are headed south and west to the small... Um, I think she's not a word, small island of the River Delta that holds the ruins of what were formerly the towns of a winding path, uh, a magical uh, place of learning uh, that was destroyed basically at the founding of the Colovian Empire and the start of the First Colovian War. Um, you have boarded the ship um, later in the evening last night, about sunset, I believe I was saying, um, made some progress uh, and then been shown a new companion um or somebody who had hoped to be a new companion to you uh aid your efforts the uh, venerable scion of the noble house of tyre um one of the most uh, up and coming noble houses of the empire um they have been put to work having had their um fancy noble garb changed for the uh, deckhand clothes of Stinky Michael. Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, What's um, your name? Stinky Michael? <laughs> Why are you called that, Michael? Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Wasn't, wasn't, it, wasn't it Dirty Michael? And, <laughs> and Doran kept saying Stinky Pete. <laughs> I think we stand Sticky Pete. Sticky Pete. Sticky Pete. Sticky Pete. It was Sticky, sticky, is even sticky worse. Michael and Sticky Pete. <laughs> <laughs> Those are the two names I have written down for that, deck hands for That exist. genuinely <laughs> sounds like a chicken wing establishment. What about a Sticky Pete? Just eat it. <laughs> it the, this ship is getting worse. <laughs> Both <laughs> the literal ship. And the ship. Oh, the ship ship. Yeah. Hey, it's ship only ship. day one. Wee! <laughs> I can still see the shore. It's not too late to swim. Um, you Go know that it. when you wake up tomorrow, or sort of wake up tomorrow, there'll be three full days um, uh, to do what you wish. Um, this night, however, uh, Zeke, when um, people met Halibut, you stuck around for a while before it was too much. Uh, you could not deal with the bullshit anymore. You asked for some pen, uh, a quill, ink, and paper, uh, and retired to what had been offered as a couple of hammocks for you and Dewey. Um, you spent most of, of, you spent the rest of the night there writing and rewriting um, with Scar as your only companion. Um, after a certain point, you um, wake up with. I say, do you wake up uh, and you know? Yeah, this is not true. <laughs> Where is everyone in relation to me? You can see Scar is right in front of you. Um, as Cleveland sat on the table um, where they were watching you write. Um, you uh, see... abs absent-mindedly just put my hand out and just smooth his head feathers, I guess? Yeah. Um, they... yeah. <laughs> is, is, is that the place to pet a bird, bird people? <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah. It's a very a delicate, like a very small but head, but yeah. yeah. There you go. That, that's what I'll go for then. Yeah. <laughs> they initially yeah. like uh, pull back, but then go. when you yeah. do it, they're like. <laughs> just lean into it. Um, you can see Dewey is in the hammock um, uh, next to you. Uh, not shoes quarters here. You know that uh, you stuck around long enough to know that um, Diana and Garrick are staying with one across from you, and taxes managed to talk themselves into the captain's quarters. Um, well, talk. You got did, offered. You got offered. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't have to do much talking. Um, and you know the captain is sleeping with the crew downstairs. Uh, okay, so first of all, I'll go to the captain's quarters then. Okay. And just going to fold the letter mm -hmm. that I've made as cleanly as I can. Hands shaking the entire time and then just slide it under the door. And then I'm going to go to where Diana's room is. And is that room much the same as the other side, where it's a barracks and there's many people there? Same as yours, where it's um, only two hammocks here. Um, okay. Um, it's uh, so as much so, as so, yes, cool, yeah. So, lo so long as I know that there's no one else that's going to be able to get it if I slide under the door, essentially. Yeah, it would be Diana or. Garrick, if they saw that first, and you <laughs> trust Garrick enough not to read anything addressed to Diana. Yeah, so much the same. Gonna fold it, and again, hands wobbling quite heavily, slide under the door, and then just climb face down into the to the hammock. And I am gonna send you both oh God. Okay. the message on Discord. Oh. It is up to yourselves whether you read it. it out loud or not. <laughs> I burn it and or... not read it. Is wow. <laughs> I can't burn anything, can... despite being a sun elf. I'll freeze You could it. also do that, but that, that is up to you. <laughs> do and you then... fancy me? Yes, no, maybe. Um, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> can you repeat can you repeat? that <laughs> question? And with that, Zeke will literally ball himself up into the hammock and just kind of lie facing the wall. Cool. Um, as oh, you, God. you know, one last thing I would say is that as you are sort of tucking yourself into a tight ball, um, you uh, hear the flutter of soft wings um, as Scar continues to reach a perch and look over, uh, and you just hear them say, "If I may." You may. You seem to do well. Putting your thoughts to paper. I'd help you in the future to do it again. Oh. It's uncomfortable. That's how you know. I can't read this. Book. It's probably helping. And then he's just going to pull the blanket up and over and just go to sleep. Mm -hmm. uh. Uh, demonic booty. <laughs> <laughs> you. Wake up the next day. It is the eighth day and what? Um, you taxis um, and Diana can see letters on the floor. Garrick is not in the room. Um, they, uh, I would say, they would have woken you up just enough to tell you that they were just going to go and help out on the sort of top deck, uh, but not to wake you up, and have left you in this room. Do you say Garrick yeah. done that? Garrick, yeah. Garrick is not in the room with you right now. Um, either you surmised they saw the letter and thought you'd want some private time and not to have somebody in the room like just, oh, what does it say? Like uh, watching you. I fell out of the hammock or... as well. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> cool. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. You have those letters, you have read them, you may choose to say whether or not um, you do anything with them, but you have then are able to read them in private and you're confident that nobody is, you know, snooping and watching. Hey, I'll, um, I'll, I'll read the letter and then I'll, I'll and then I'll go in the book. See it's fine, it is your, again, your choice whether you read it out loud or whether you read it for yourselves. I'm reading it. Do they taxes also read, but she won't read it out loud. Oh, well. Makes sense. 
It's too much. <laughs> um, I will describe um, some of the fun. Obviously, I'm giving you time to read that for yourself, Bree. Um, but you are then able to keep it away. Uh, you decide whether you use a pocket letter, probably something like that, um, and get out your spell book. Once again, the vision in your mind uh, as you feel like you are being pulled forward and into a book um, of tree-like roots, um, that's not quite correct, paths that look like tree roots curling and winding their way in every direction into the far distance. But you know the way to travel now um, as you walk up and along the path that leads to where this illusory version of your mother uh, is waiting for you as ever. Um, the space here always looks like um, looks like an open air classroom. They are so, uh, on this stool stump kind of thing and look up and smile. Hey. Hello, Diana. Uh, good morning. It's morning. It's morning. That is good to know. How you doing? I continue to always be me. I'm doing well. Okay, good. <laughs> I don't know what that means. Um, cool. Uh, I had a question that concerns a friend of mine. Um. Sure. Uh. What kind of, so, my friend is, um, very in tune with nature, right? And, um, he has these birds flying around him all the time. And, and then we were in a place where there was no birds, and then there was no birds. There was just, like, bats and stuff flying around him all the time. Uh, I was wondering if you knew what kind of magic that was. Hmm. Uh, that is the extent of your uh, illusion. I know. Illusion is a possibility. It seems more with these birds uh, or creatures that surround them, are, are they tangible? Can you put, um, can you make contact? Can they impact things? Mm, yeah. Ah, okay, so maybe we're looking more in the nature of um, conjuration, or indeed the way that they are trained to themselves, transmutation, or maybe something else uh, together. Rather than being a spell themselves, they are somehow uh, magical beings in their nature. Do you know where you're... Um, your friend acquired his power? No, I think, uh, I think it ha- I think it ha- I don't know. I don't know. D uh, do we know that, um, Dewey's mother was a druid? Do we know I that? I remember Phil has... I mean, no, I didn't, um, I mean, Dewey didn't know his mum was a druid, he just knew that his mum loved the woods, basically. <laughs> and um, taking her and... away from her killed her. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. That's that's literally the way he describes it. Okay. Um no, I don't I don't think he I don't not I don't think he was born with it. I, I think it was like a uh one day they started coming to him, I think. I'm not totally sure. Hmm. Um He's very skilled. He I think he has some magic. And I don't know what kind of thing that is. He's not learned like me. He doesn't use an instrument. He uh, he's not a warlock. I... Intuitive natural magic that yeah. lies on beings that change. Is your friend also from Fenrir? Uh, yeah, I believe so. Uh, half elf. Hmm. Half halfling. I'm not entirely aware of 
um, what the real me um, may have told you after forming me. Um, I believe we spoke a bit about my family, um, but the elves yeah. in the forest of Fenrion, some of them employ uh, what we refer to as druidic magic. Um, magic. Magic in the sense, uh, perhaps best to think of it as uh, an old faith, um, rather than worship for God, just the, the old power of nature of the world, nature itself. Beings tied to that, tied to nature, may well be described as something we call fey. Um, like a uh, fey, like, uh, like elves? Is that a staff? We're fey, right? Is that fey? I don't know. We have very common aspects for fey. There's a. I get, they make that face that you've seen them make before, where they are. It's like they know something, but they don't. They, yeah. They know something, and yet it's been snipped. There's something in Fenrion Forest. We are from, well, my, my side of the family is from there. Your father, um, generally not so much. Um, the druids there. Um, there is power to their magic, and that I think I make a check. Uh, yeah, I'll say we we've come across a druid before. Uh, uh, he doesn't have as much magic as as that druid. You know. But yeah. Okay. Whilst the real me may have cut something there, every time I try and think of magic linked to Fae and Fenrion Forest is exactly where I find that cut, so one can only surmise that um, whatever um, the real me has deigned not to give me, in hopes that the information could not be misused if I would not be found by you, there is some connection to the Fae in Fenrion Forest and some connection to Fae power potentially there. Whether that is uh, purely natural or um, some other way to aspect um, that sort of yeah. the power from that realm, the, 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 the fey realm, uh, the fey wilds, the realm of light. Um, and we know that, like, uh, do we know that, you, like, general knowledge, like? You would maybe not know general knowledge. Um, this is a while ago, but you remember, um, not to reference them too much or bring them too much, um, Badger left a party um, to go and chase some kind of um, oh, yeah, fae. power that they felt calling to them there. And there were lots of fae, um, these uh, sort of fae of uh, rot and decay um, that were trying to get into uh, the tomb um, but were blocked specifically by cold iron that blocked fae. Um, so it's quite possible. Um, that there is some something fey and fairy going on in Fenrion Forest, which is fun to say. <laughs> fey and fairy in Fenrion Forest. Oh, lots of Kavlafrenia die. Hmm. And that <laughs> seems to be connected to, uh, <laughs> it seems that may well be connected to Dewey's power and um, all the source of Dewey's power. Interesting. Thanks, Mama. I'm glad. Always to be a help. Hmm. That's book, Mom. The more you know. <laughs> <laughs> um, <clears throat> yeah. I'm going to put Sam on the spot now. Ooh, sorry. Uh oh. Don't get me a Sazrus. No, it's not that. It's not that. Okay. It's like a personal okay. thing. And that okay. it's, I don't know, so you can make shit up. <laughs> cool. Uh, I haven't gone into this part of my backstory. Um, but, uh, yeah. So, like, you're away a lot in school. Mm. Like, 
I don't know what I'm saying. It's obvious that she's like, yeah, could like, you know what I mean? Obvious to most people, uh, Faudia S is going to make a insight check. <laughs> <laughs> Great. Faudia S is uh, on a rare moment of um, empathy, rolls a natural 20. Wow. I am. Um, I was busy, or perhaps it is better to say I busied myself. I remember always wishing to be back more with you and your father, and I remember also wishing to be back at the school and furthering the study of magic when I was with you. I Split. had many passions, many drives. Yeah. I should quite like to know when we find me Whatever force was powerful enough to keep me from you, because I do not know of one. Oh, <laughs> oh God. Unconscious Diana, Tia. <laughs> oh. I'm gonna make Bree cry tonight. <laughs> <laughs> this is the twi this is twice now, and we're like, what, 20 minutes into it? Uh. uh Okay. Well, how, um, <clears throat> how did you, you obviously with, with dad and you had me, how, how, path from magic, how did you know that was the right thing for you to do? I knew that I loved your father, not from the moment that I met him. <laughs> Found him quite silly. <laughs> it was not something I had appreciated at the time until I learned to appreciate the silly things. Joy it brought me. And I knew it was right to start a family. When I I knew words are often my friend. Um, they can teach me a great deal about the world. I wish I could tell you in words how I knew it was time to bring a new life into this world, one that I could cherish, call my own, teach all of the things that I found amazing and hoped would live to be more amazing and find new joy. Hope to make the things I liked about myself and the things I loved about your father into something greater than the two of us. And yet even now the words do not do you justice. I don't know that I knew then it was time. I know now that I made the right decision. Okay. That was helpful and also not that helpful, but yeah, no, that's felt helpful. And that is the exact story uh, of my how my grandparents met too. <laughs> I was like, ah, <laughs> yeah. She also thought he was very silly, uh, and he <laughs> and he pursued her <laughs> until <laughs> she didn't think he was silly anymore. <laughs> <laughs> 
Thanks, Sam. That's okay. Nothing wrong with being silly. I know. Silly <laughs> <Maybe> last. <laughs> <laughs> it's just another tick for Halle, in my opinion, you know. Halle's silly, he's strong, he's a blacksmith. I mean, why Why do you think she? he, like, broke her in the first place? Yeah. Damn, I've got a second chance. <laughs> There's still a slight chance, is there? <laughs> There's a point where you become too much like someone's dad, and it's like, mm, I might just take mm. my dad at this point. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thanks, Mama. Anytime. Yeah. I'll give her a hug. If she accepts it. <laughs> oh, yes, yes, she does. <laughs> she hugs you deeply. Okay. Um, and I will come out of the book. And I will read Zeke's letter. Okay. Mm. It is uh, Dawn, who I will say, apart from one person, because you, however, are woken up bright and early. Um, you are uh, handed some gloves this time so that your rope burn won't be as bad as they. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, march wow. you out um, and. Uh, make an athletics check. This is very thoughtful. Thank you very much for the report. Now, so you're getting some help today, so um, make it an advantage. Uh, uh, a 15 and an 18. How about my boy? Oh, it's it's a, a 17. It's minus one. It's, it's minus one. It's a 17. <laughs> 17 is still pretty good and certainly good enough um, that uh, you adjust your stance. You know when the tension is about to hit the rope and you're able to brace yourself. Um, the strength has less to do with it than you know a little bit more of what's going on, uh, and um, you're able to sort of, with like, one hand be grabbing the other one to like, hook your arm around something solid like one of the masts, um, so that you actually have um, some bearing to you. Um, for this morning, and as dawn is rising in the east behind you, um, there is a better day of doing the grunt work that is going to prove that you are genuinely on board for this. Ah, see? Yesterday I was just rusty. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Thinking Michael just gives you, like, a yeah, right? <laughs> um, Praxis would like to go and find Seek. Mm, okay. Zeke is still in bed. He is still in the hammock, all curled up. He is awake, but he is just under the blanket. I wish I was there first so I can tip it upside down. Carry on. <laughs> wow. I'm nicer. I knock on the door. <laughs> if he doesn't answer, I'll tip it upside down. <laughs> You're going to announce who it is, or I'll just knock on the like... door and then just leave me to wait? I'm going to knock on the door and be like, this taxes. And then if he doesn't answer, I'll tip him off. <laughs> uh, okay. So I'll come in. He's just going to sit up. Um, uh... I should check. Is Dewey in the room? Because this is a, a shared room. Ah, uh, yes. Uh, he is. He's, uh, if you turn over, Dewey's just kind of laying, staring at the ceiling. Cool. Also, does this happen while I'm in the book or does it happen afterwards? Because I can hear, <laughs> hear it outside the door. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> it's the first thing taxes would do, so it depends upon. Yeah, no, that's um, fair. Yeah, at some point along this, you probably come out. But... Yeah, I'd like to sleep, so yeah, that's fine. <laughs> you know, two birds, one stone, kind of thing. So. <laughs> uh, as Zeke gets out of the hammock, very haphazardly, uh. The bags under his eyes are very dark and deep. He doesn't look like he's slept very much the entire night. Uh, hi. I was going to ask if you wanted to train with me, but you look tired. No, I can train. I can do. Uh, 
you know, look down and realize, like, do the whole thing of, I should probably put some clothes on. Oh, I only own this one pair of set of clothes. <laughs> and just walk straight out. <laughs> I'm going to be Stinky Pete before long. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I don't think we have a lot of sets of clothes between us. I think we're, we're all Stinky Pete's, really. Mm -hmm. I mean, we have so many sets of clothes. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. We have periodically <laughs> washed. Like, as soon as oh, we yeah. got out of the thing, like, Diana would have been naked and washing. You know what I mean? Like, it's just like, it's. It's oh yeah, I'm aware, but but, <laughs> but 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 there's clean, and then there's you know, washed and put straight back on. You gotta wash the clothes. Do we have a million <laughs> bars of soap as well? Yeah, I was gonna say Pete <laughs> has like a bunch of soap, and also she also has spare clothes because she was clever and packed. <laughs> I went pack? to a gig. I went to a gig. Ended exactly. up on the run of my running for my life. <laughs> My hero yeah, foot wasn't says prepared. I have like three <laughs> bags. I have a magic bag, I have actual bag, and I have another actual bag. I have oh, literally one of heroes. I have two bags <laughs> under my eyes. <laughs> wow. Yeah, so I like most bags that I also have. <laughs> Does Diana yeah, have passive vegetation? Just... No, but I really yeah. should. <laughs> Maybe it'll be the next thing on the next level up. <laughs> <laughs> Next uh, time yeah, I I'll, I'll follow you yeah. wherever you're going. I mean, I'm just going to go pull up a deck. This is a rare opportunity to be kick on ass. a ship. Or kick his ass. <laughs> <laughs> also, also that. Yeah. Also that. Kick his ass. Uh, Too nice. Full, con full contact sparring, or we just emulate uh, movements? I just emulate movements. Uh, okay. Uh, you okay? And just kind of and just write writes himself as much as he can. Following you. I mean you knew no more monk stuff than I do. Then if you are willing to follow, I will show you what little I know. And I will just go through standard basic, basic stretch movements and basic attacks to limber up the body, essentially. Are Important. you doing this out in the open? Yes. Mm. Working on the... Make, doing the fundamentals because a, a person who has thrown one punch a thousand times is more dangerous than someone who has thrown a thousand punches one time. Well, just Are you okay? <laughs> I'm I'm really tired. I um yeah. And he's just gonna turn and smile at you. Just I'm no like a genuine, like soft smile, just I'm tired. There's no there's no bravado today. Same. I would say she smiled back for you and has a hood on because she does not trust this ship. <laughs> it's fine. How are you? Tired. <laughs> um, thank you for your letter, by the way. Words on paper are easier to understand than in the moment emotion. It is the first time that I have picked up a quill since I written but I wrote my mother's eulogy um I haven't I haven't touched anything apart from a bottle for 
30, close 40 years. Um, it was, it was hard. It took a, took a lot to remember how to write. Not just the movements, but how to say what you're thinking. I'm sorry that it took me so long to get there. I could say it's okay, but yeah. I know it's, it's not okay, and I, I and I don't I don't expect you know. He's just gonna clam up again. Just I I I mm, I, I said it in the letter. Mm. I. I That, that's what spatters. Like I said, words on paper are more powerful than emotions in the moment. Um, can we do something to make this a little less awkward? Sure, I was trying not to be awkward. <laughs> I, 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 it's mostly because there's people wandering around. Yeah. Um, you, you are old. One free hit from the mine, the first time we got to it, on Siege's side. Mm. He's just going to put his hands behind his back. And this isn't bravado. We're going to spar. Show me your best hit. I, I've been just been waiting for this moment. <laughs> He's just gonna stand there. Try for tea. All things as they should be. <laughs> uh, that's. <laughs> 13 points of bludgeoning damage <laughs> Uh What are you doing specifically? Oh, I should just punch you straight in the fucking face. <laughs> cool. No, no, monk, no monk shit. Just... <laughs> yeah. yeah just, just a hard haymaker. You are 100% give, being given your privacy, but people on the deck who can hear the swarm, like the absolute one that you take there, everybody looks around um, and just carries on their business, nothing to do with them. going to try and stagger to, to roll with it, but probably lose my balance with, with the ship. And then just... <sighs> That was my broken hand. Sorry. That was a lot of aggression. I am trying to you're work you, aggression. Well, you're getting better. Well, yeah. Learn to use your knuckle a bit more. I did last time oh. and it broke. You... Do you mind? And he walks up to you and just, just unfurl your hand. Hmm. Use the palm of your hands rather than your knuckles. If you can strengthen your wrists, it is a much wider form of damage, but you're less likely to break anything. Hmm. It'll take time to practice, but you'll save your hand for a while. While it recovers. Mm. I appreciate that. Thank Halley. He always used to smack, smack me around with open hands because I, I could never reach his face to hit him hard. <laughs> I miss him. I miss him too. Gonna put your hand, her hand on your shoulder, like just, just be nice. Uh, I didn't do much of a tour when we got on here. Do you know where the captain is staying? It's um, 
area with the other crew, I imagine. Like, I just want to ask him some questions, if that's okay. Yeah. Oh, um, by the way, um, your name, Saferbu. I... I trust you. You are one of three people who are still alive who now know it. The other one being myself, and the other, Diana. Okay, so, stay with me. He's gonna, he's gonna try and straighten himself up again and then just, uh, I'm gonna go try and be useful. So. He's just gonna wander off and absentmindedly probably wander up to the new Hal with whatever he is working on. Hmm. Just seeing that he's probably struggling to pull on something and just just helping. Doing my best. <laughs> You say you come in and help me. Amazing. Yeah, he doesn't really recognize who you are because you are in <clears throat> filthy clothing now. On deck with n none of your eccentricities. And I don't know that you've been sent to go do this, so I just see that you're just struggling through me. I'm just going to go help. Okay. Harbour doesn't say anything. Just appreciates the help. Oh, and that's me for unless Diana wants to come and find me too. Nope. <laughs> or do we? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, well, Sam. Not even the captain. <laughs> Not, Not even, even captain. Sam, yeah. <laughs> Nobody. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh wow. Muted Sam. Yeah, More than a single tear. <laughs> Okay, it didn't even do anything that time, it just cracked. Yeah. <laughs> She's alone in the room as well. No one saw Diana crying. No one. Yep. <laughs> if you did, I'll kill you. <laughs> um, yeah, monkey's yeah. like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The monkey is kind Milo. of like trying to open the door. He's just like. <laughs> just try to open the door. I'm like, ugh. Uh, weight to actually pull the Yeah, hand. <laughs> standing on the thing. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, I'll open the door for him and I'll be like, uh, go and check on, um, you know, what's his name? The fish. And then, and then also Zeke. Okay. Okay. High five. Little high, little. High five with the monkey. Great. See you later. <laughs> ah! Yeah, it's not hard to find these two there on the main deck. Um, and so, my life <clears throat> position, same position we were in yesterday, uh, watching uh, how the. <laughs> um, uh, I think he's going to enjoy the um, the rigging as well. That's fun. Yeah. Uh, at some point, uh, maybe an hour after this, um, Captain Blake um, comes aboard. Uh, you hear um, it would be in this position. Uh, you see, mm -hmm. um, following after them, um, quickly in tow, um, a, a shorter individual, sort of dwarven stature, maybe a bit more. Um, very, very hairy. Um, Looks like he's not just dwarf in there. Um, and, and as they follow behind, they say, Captain on deck! Uh, and everybody's like, hi, hi! Uh, as, as the captain like steps out, um, salutes, uh, and takes their position, taking control of the wheel um, from uh, a... Uh, it would be a... Uh, actually, probably needs to be another human um, that's clearly been given the wheel um, while Blake has been getting along resting. Um, 
uh, and they are now standing at the wheel. Uh, you can see speed picks up immediately uh, as the uh, wind uh, blows perfectly in the direction of the sails yet again, uh, mm. filling them out perfectly. And uh, it's yeah, it's rather than okay, we have to sort of keep the sails like half or even like quarter to sort of catch just enough wind to keep us going, but not to blow us off course. Now you can go full sail directly into the wind and speed picks up again. Ah, that's how he's been doing it. Um, I'd like to go see Dewey. Please. Uh, is he still in the room? Maybe be out. Yeah, what, uh, what time of day is it now? I would have come in. Past all. Yeah, I would have, yeah, I would have come in straight away, like I sent a Marlow off and then I'll go. Okay. I'll come in, whatever. Well, I'll just follow, walk around until I find you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. If it's if it's just after dawn, then he'd probably, he'd probably still be staring at the ceiling and in the bunk. Knock on the door. It's down there. Uh, yep. Cool. I'll walk. I'll go in. Uh, hey, no, kid. He hops What's up. At, hops. Frustratingly easily out of the <laughs> out of the hammock. Uh, Diana is visibly annoyed. <laughs> mm. Okay. Ah, morning. An actual bed. Morning. Well, In it's a, a hammock. Um, I don't an fall actual, out of bed actual... every five minutes. So. Net net of strings. Um, it's it's, it's still better than that. Um. Yeah. You're right. Yeah, you? Yeah. Is that true? <laughs> Not very good at insights. Is insight that true? Insight check. Insight check. Oh, insight check. I don't, I'm not very good at that. I have an 11. Is that true? I say it out loud because I don't, can't nine. insight. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nine. Uh, I, rolled a, I rolled a 19 on a, yeah. on a, a charisma based check. Yeah. Yeah, I'm like, yeah, not bad. It's good to, it's good to have some comfort. All right, cool. For once, it's good, and we can go upstairs and see the sun again. That is That's... good. That is good. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Well, this conversation is going to end because I was hoping you were going to say no. <coughs> yeah, that's it. Okay, <laughs> let's sorry, go there. Sorry. sorry. <laughs> Oh, cool. All right. Well, um, <laughs> I. <laughs> well, in that case, uh, uh, yeah. Um, I um, I, I spoke to my mom, book mom, not the real one. Um, book mom? she's yeah. Uh, otherwise indisposed. Um, <clears throat> the the one in the book. You know that one. Yeah. Uh, I asked her about the birds and stuff, and the minging bats. Oh. Um, yeah. Uh, I hope you didn't mind. I hope you don't mind. Um. No, I no. Okay, cool. Um, she she's she's very knowledgeable, so she seems to think that um, they're like. It's like a fey magic. Not. Magic? Not, you know, not, yeah, like, not like a wizard or like a sorcerer or a warlock or a druid or anything like that. It's like fey, more like druid, kind of fey beings of some kind. Uh-huh. So, glazed look on Bruce's <laughs> face. Yeah. Do you know? Do you know? Traditionally, the elves come from the forest. Like my um, mom was yeah. born in the forest before she went and settled in uh, Hawning's Rest, which wasn't really anything at the time, but grew to what we know today. But they started off in the forest. So, okay. elves have this like druidic fey connection. Okay. Try 
kind of say it in a way that Diana would know is difficult. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you know? Um, and I think, because you got Elf in you, so um, maybe it's coming from that my side. My mother's side? Yep. I think that's, that, I, I guess that makes sense. No one else I've ever met has done this kind of thing. So, yeah. yeah. So maybe they're not like real birds, they're like fae. So, are you saying I'm magic? Well, yeah, you're just so like you do way magic shit. It's magic. <laughs> wow. Oh, okay. <clears throat> okay. Yeah. Has the so. face of someone who you, looks like he doesn't properly understand what you've just said, but is like has has picked words that you said that he's like, oh, cool. <laughs> So yeah, next time you see the birds, then see what you can do. Think of it like magic and see what, what happens. I know. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay, and he, he just makes the go up on deck. Yeah, and then Diana is left like in, in Dewey and Zeke's room like, in like interest, like he's so like sort of like okay, listen to what she said and just yeah. just, just just leaves. <laughs> I was it's like, huh. like, cool. <laughs> I will also leave then. <laughs> um, and everyone on deck will see sort of Dewey sort of scamper up on deck and then walk to this like the 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 side of the ship and be like, Craig. <clears throat> Craig, and then a pigeon <laughs> like just lands on the side of the ship. Oh. <laughs> so Craig, the like... fat one. Yes, he's the yeah, the, the, the <laughs> big, big <fat> pigeon. <laughs> like... I thought I remembered that name. I was like, yeah. <laughs> and pigeon kind of does the whole, just looks at him, and Dewey looks at it, and it's like, like doesn't quite get what Dewey's thinking, and Dewey like. Pokes him in his tummy. <laughs> so you're like, wow. Are you real, Craig? <laughs> One eyebrow goes up. <laughs> and it just kind of does the whole fluffs up like... <laughs> it's like... Okay. That's not what I said. I said they were right. real. They were fake. <laughs> Alright. Okay. I didn't say they were real. Maybe I did. I remember. Um, he just like puts his face really close to like stare at him and it just stare at the little stare off and then eventually the pigeon just kind of goes like pecks him on the nose. He's like, oh! <laughs> 100%. <laughs> okay. Alright. Fine. And looks at a nearby sailor who's just like, what the fuck is going on? It's like, <laughs> Multiple hi. nearby sailors. <laughs> yeah, so, hi. Halibut included. Um, this is included. This, <laughs> and this, I and I come is... come up after him like. <sighs> so, uh, Sorry. Th this this is Craig. <laughs> I thought for sure they were about to make out. <laughs> ten side contact, right? <laughs> I guess that's why they call him the Scarecrow. Uh, Sticky Pete. <laughs> <laughs> Sticky oh, Pete's done God. weirder things. I can tell, Sticky Pete. <laughs> <laughs> you, sure keep, has. you keep telling me. You've, tell, you've told me 15 <laughs> times. It's <laughs> been half gone. <laughs> like you are. <laughs> oh god, not again. I will yeah. Go. I yeah, I don't know. I will go I will go see Captain Blake. And he just got mm -hmm. there. Yes. Uh 
I, I, I suppose it's a lot busier than like it was yesterday. Busier than it was yeah. uh, last night. Um, lots of deckhands around here. Good progress can be made in the sunlight. Um, yeah. Ah, Anna. Good morning. Morning, mate. Mate. Uh, how long are you going to be here? How long oh, do you shift? <laughs> Once my shift. Uh, as long as I can handle, usually. Um, hmm. Most of the day, certainly until noon. Long past. All right. Goes to, like, turn away. <laughs> I'll make sure you know how to find me. Come back. Yeah. You find me. I want to see what you can do. And then leave. Literally no context. <laughs> yep. Right, I'm just literally went up to someone and like, so how, how long are you off work? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Uh... How long are you off work and tell me, uh, come and find me so you can show me what you can do. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Anybody else wish to do anything this morning before that? <laughs> Can I go and eat? I would. Yeah, go for it. <laughs> slightly, later the monkey's watching. The, <laughs> slightly later on in the evening, mm -hmm. uh, when um, Adam's like, say, swabbing the deck or something, when he's like somewhat alone. Okay. Um, he's gonna try and lock eye, lock an eye with uh, Dagwin. Mm -hmm. Uh, he's like, raise his eyebrow. So she can speak to him in his head. Yep, I'm gonna find Dagwin's character sheet again for sidekick. DM is loading. 100% should have had this. Just ready to go. <laughs> it's fine. Ah, where is it? There it is. Cool. Go for it. Uh, uh, yes, uh, yeah, you feel the connection open up. Oh, what do you want, Ben? <laughs> I'm still helping this old man out. Yeah. Well, Are you being, I, I, I'm being I, subtle I, I, about this, or do you uh, just That's what I'm asking. Is, I'm not asking well, it, like, this is like, like... Yeah. If you wish to try and be subtle about it, make a stealth check. Okie dokie. Just because I'm immediately helping him with all the heavy lifting that he can't do. <laughs> yeah. Or would he there have waited? A... Hold on. I, I did wait a little bit, but I'm okay with this. That is a... Oh, God. 70 plus 4. <laughs> My brain. 21. 21. I'm so bad at math. Why macro? Help me. <laughs> yeah. You are oh, certainly oh, stuck. Far past passive. Yeah. Um, are you here in your head? Everything all right? Yeah, uh, I was wondering... the. Young young miss in a mask, known uh, as the Shadow. Could you fetch her and bring her over to me? Thought you were a working man now. I I am I am I'm working. Okay, this is why I asked you to get her. <laughs> wow, Gero. She rolls her eyes visibly, ties something off, uh, and um, I, I guess at this point uh, just goes to find. Um, taxis. She's not like got a perfect run of the ship, much as you don't. Um, no, but yeah. I, was, I was there. Um, Probably better than me, though. <laughs> yes. Uh, but taxis, you see this uh, crystal scale, topaz, uh, dragonborn woman. Um, tall, like very muscular build. Uh, comes up to you and says, um, You're Shadow, right? Um, that's what they choose to call me, yes? What should we call you? Taxes. Okay, Taxes. Mm. Uh, I realise we're still building a relationship here. Sure. Could you come and talk to Halbert? Why? Probably um, so they can ask for a chess rematch. I don't know. Insight. If I know. Make an insight check, yeah, yeah. How do I know? I just did it on that. Why did I do it on that? I was have it. 16. 16. Um, you get the impression that she um, 
she genuinely doesn't know the reason, um, but she doesn't think anything bad is going to happen. It's not like she's hiding in ambush. Um, and at the same time, it's not like she would be unaware. You think she's got a comfortable, relaxed, like, it's not like, I don't know what's going to happen. I've just been told it, but anything could happen. It's like, no, he's not going to do anything. She's confident that she's not leading you into an ambush or anything like that. It's just going to have a chat. Um, and why they didn't come and ask themselves, they are a noble. It's not entirely, um, unusual for these kind of people to send retainers. I talk about enough rich people, I know yeah. exactly what they're like. <laughs> uh, I'll follow. <laughs> cool. Um, back to uh, the main deck um, where you're working. There's a sort of point where you get a break. I'll say um, this sort of... Uh, you said evening, but obviously that's um, going to be before. Um, uh, that's going to be straight. That's going to be after Blake comes away, so it's probably going to be Start of the afternoon, if that's okay. Uh, Halibut turns like, thank you very much for your help. It's very appreciated. Because uh, you were helping them with the... Wait. Since when oh, are you allowed to you age? Ah, sorry. I thought you knew who you were helping. My apologies. Uh, it was you meant to be some of the floor. Walk away from him. <laughs> very well. <sighs> Wait, so I felt emotion in a moment. <laughs> oh, we almost got there, didn't we, see? God no. damn it. <laughs> so close. So close. Wow. <laughs> oh, shit. Taxes, uh, you probably just see Zeke walking away. As um, You're allowed to take a break. We're not going to work you <clears throat> beyond the point where you just break um, your body, so you can find a bit space uh you you come in as halbert like <sighs> ah yes young taxes um how he looks around is there any one other than dagwin here um if you're trying in, within to... earshot beyond uh within earshot yeah with beyond like whispered earshot now how what is your relationship with Captain Blake? How how much do you know of him? Are you quite familiar? He is like whispered ish breath. Why do you want to know? I've I've only been his captor for several days now, but I've noticed something odd about him. I'm not talking about the ship being able to move with speed. I've just know something odd. I can't really put my finger on it. Seems somewhat familiar, but I, I have no idea. Maybe you could bring something out. Maybe you knew. I don't know. I just didn't want you to get caught up with whatever potential secret you might be holding. And you're the only one who kind of talked to me and played a game with me, so I thought I should ask tell you. Just well. in case. That 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 is literally it. That um, yeah. Okay. Just maybe keep an eye on him. I don't know. It could be it. He could be anything. I assume he's still a good person. It's just he's hiding something. But again, uh, but then again, aren't we all? Well, what are you hiding then? <laughs> <sighs> maybe. Mm, oh, maybe I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> Uh, should not have said that. What a twat. <laughs> should not should, have said should that. Not have should not have said that. that. Should not have said that. <laughs> My apologies, I got a bit too comfortable there. <laughs> uh, that will require a private room. Oh boy. A chest later. Very well. See them. My break is <laughs> also. Apologies. I can keep an eye on Blakely. Not not for the reason you asked, but if he's hiding something, then I would love to know. Yeah. Well, I don't. <clears throat> I don't personally have much stock in it. It's just 
something doesn't feel right, if you understand. Or maybe feels too familiar, I... Okay. Feels weird. Doesn't seem to be all that he seems. Hmm. I'll, um... I... You don't have to tell me if you find any. It's just... I probably won't. Do whatever. Yes. Do what right. you want with the information. I, uh... Thank you for giving me a heads up. You might already know, and it's uh, just something I found out on my own. I, I... Mm. Mm. Yeah. Okay. When it looks like you're gonna finish up, uh, Diana will walk up to taxes and do like the whole like you know like someone someone's there, and then she kind of comes up and is like. <laughs> Everything okay? <clears throat> yeah. Like really close. Um of course. Uh yeah. Uh he's um <laughs> I would say it too, he's concerned about the captain. Hmm. I'm sure the feeling is mutual. Uh yeah. I need a I need a I need to freeze the head. Oh, like, just do that away from him. <laughs> <laughs> well, just like, I just need something from the bag. Yeah, and then just open the bag. <laughs> okay, cool. Cool. <coughs> oh. Jesus Christ. That's not great in there. You refreeze. They tell you not to refreeze the heads or to, like, um, have to, uh, but. Well, you know. Ho <laughs> hopefully, we've kept up with it, but. The smell from the bag says otherwise. <laughs> We're gonna have to buy a new bag. <sighs> it's fine. I will get prestidigitation. We'll we'll do the inside of the bag. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's kind of what that's kind of it. Just... Okay, bye. Enjoy. <laughs> As you say goodbye and enjoy it and sort of um, leave the sort of semi-private <laughs> space. Um, you see uh, Captain Blake uh, sort of opening the door just as you're <clears throat> turning to leave. Uh, uh, and says, I found you. You did? With taxes. Yes. Is this going to be more interesting than I thought? <laughs> <laughs> I thought they were out on the deck. They, they, they were, and they were coming. Uh, they, you said to find them, and um, oh no, uh, I thought taxes was. Oh, out you thought taxes was out on deck. Okay, I'll say easily enough for uh, rather than rather than uh, certainly off in a quiet space uh, than on the deck. Uh, rather okay. than the door, cool. just you turn around and he's there. Yeah, yeah, I'm just busying myself for like a couple of hours. I don't know what to do. I can't do stuff. Uh, I mean, I could. I'm not very strong. Basically, I'm just walking around, looking at things and people. I don't know. Uh, and then he's there. Cool. Yeah. I'll say to find like a more private space, probably on the forecastle. So like at the very front of the ship is where this is all going. Sense okay. to me. Yeah, yeah. Ah, so you want to see what I can do? Yeah. With. Your magic. See. <laughs> if, uh, with what Immediately I'm... disappointed. <laughs> see, seeing this flirt in taxes is walking away. <laughs> I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> that's the secret. Figured it out. <laughs> yeah, that's the side eye from Diana. Mm. Much like I told you, Diana, I have no proper training i've just sort of had to figure this out um but what i have figured out uh they what, what do you want to see i want to help you figure it out okay. a bit yeah sorry sam <laughs> well um i can help people in certain ways um they uh, put a hand on your shoulder and you feel the two of you immediately lift into the air, ten foot, 
And as he lets go, you stay there uh, as they cast the fly spell on you. Um, and Do results. I know what this is? Um, make an arcana check. Damn, I wish taxes stayed. I would have been amazed. <laughs> <laughs> Is uh, this the Titanic moment? I feel like I'm flying. Oh, fuck, I am. Oh, shit, I <laughs> am. Uh, soft 20. Uh, soft 20. Yeah, you, you've heard of um, mages being able to cast spells that allow them to fly. Um, this, uh, you can feel like wind buffeting you um, from beneath, uh, but you feel like you could, you have full control of this. You can decide where you go. You feel like you can go quite fast. Is, is this like a, because we're out on deck, yeah? Is this like a secret thing no, that you're, he you're... can do, that he can he can do magic and stuff? No, the whole crew um, right. look up and see it, um, so I keep watching, uh, but it doesn't seem to be like, oh my god, they can cast magic. Yeah, okay, it's cool. very open on the yeah, I will, I will just, I fucking amazing, I'm flying. <laughs> I'll just, just, just go. Like, just... Yeah, you have a 60 foot fly speed um, <clears throat> as per the spell. Oh my um, god, that's Peter Pan this shit! I will say on the, <laughs> on the 20 arcana check you got, that first 10 foot off of the ground, you think that was more purely the nature of their magic than the spell that was being cast, as though they can do that just by the nature of how their magic works. Because uh, I know Dewey thing. can do it to 10 foot, so I'm yeah. like, huh. Well, I mean, yeah, that's cause his that's because his birds have got to lift him, and they're tight, yeah, that's, tiny. That's true. So <laughs> oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah, that's fair. Dewey is part way up the rigging, by the way, at this point. So <laughs> I mean, yeah, I will, full I'll, European yeah, adventure. I will, um, uh, like, <laughs> uh, does does Blake join? Like, I was gonna say, for their part, Blake uh, has like um, hands, like it's standing on deck pose, uh, and just allows himself to drift forward and around with a big smile on their face. Um, <clears throat> I'll try and make it look elegant, as elegant as possible. <laughs> yeah, do a performance check. <laughs> oh no. Okay. Or acrobatics, do... your choice. Um. You're a bard. What do you mean, oh no? <laughs> not my strongest thing. Okay. <laughs> I told you I'm a jack of all trades. <laughs> I'm not very good at anything <laughs> except for lion. Oh, hey up. Oh. Uh, uh, performance is a 26. Yay! 26. Uh, you are <laughs> a vision as you are, like, 30, like, test limits. Okay, here's how fast I can go. Here's how much control I have. Seems to be perfect. Uh, and then you are, uh, spiraling, you know, you describe to me exactly what you want to do, and you, you do that. Uh, yeah, um, I mean... Spectacular. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I will go sort of up, and then I'll see Dewey halfway up the rigging. I'll just, like, go... And just poke him, and then I'll go around, uh, uh, sort of around uh, the masts, and then <clears throat> just sort of see how high I can go. Yeah, I mean, you keep going up and up and up. Um, <laughs> oh no, that's not. <laughs> that's not <good. laughs> you keep going, but they shout after you, Baby Diana. I would expect that's finishing in about ten minutes, so not too high. <laughs> does he he climb, or does he stay down there? He sort of uh, gently, he sort of flows. Whereas well, you go high, you watch as he goes along the edge of the ship and just sort of um, lies backwards like this, uh, keeping level with the river uh, alongside the ship, um, just floating like an inch off of the surface of the river, um, letting oh, all the yeah. water just spray into their hair. Uh, at a certain point, he brings the uh, captain's hat down over his head like he's sunbathing as he like flies along the side of the ship. I'll fly down and I'll take his hat. Yes! Uh, make a... <laughs> Make a stealth check. <laughs> Advantage, because I just said he covered his eyes. Yeah. <laughs> so it's you are invisible to him. I um, think Alan could just pull Fortune on deck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, t- uh, 24. 24. Now I can roll. Yeah. Well. <laughs> uh, you dart down, get the hat, uh, he sees you, uh, <laughs> and immediately gives chase. Um, <laughs> just chasing you around the ship. Uh, taxis at this point, Garrett comes over to you just like, <laughs> what do you say? I can go invisible, that's not that special. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I mean, ten, 10 minutes, I can go, I mean, let me do it for an hour, so you know, talk about lasting longer. It's a good, uh, 
duration game, you know. <laughs> I wish I could hear him because I you would do invisibility. I I wish I could because I would do invisibility right now. <laughs> um, as they are floating there, uh, sort of following along the type of ship, uh, at one point they sort of uh, realize that you are, they're not going to be able to catch up with you because you are just as fast. Um, they um, say, fair enough. You hold I'll... back. I can always. Um, they. Uh, can you make me a, a oh. strength saving throw, please? No, I can't. Uh, I was going to say, can I disguise self as him and then put the hat on? <laughs> uh, you do that. They disguise self as you. Yes! <laughs> um, this is a weird uh, kink. <laughs> and, then you can, and then as you're both smiling at each other, like, haha, um, uh, then... can you make me a strength saving throw? Oh, fuck's sakes. During this time, Taxes gets Gallic a drink and they both chin Yeah. <laughs> Natural one. Um, you see, as they say, I can also, <laughs> and they just, you just see spark of lightning along their hand as a lightning lure comes out, hits the hat, and not you, as they whip the hat back towards themselves. Uh, it's singed a little bit, and you see as they cast Prestidigitation just to uh, put out any singeing on it, uh, take a deep bow as they put it on their head. Again, flying midair, about level of the crow's nest, or just above the crow's nest. Okay, 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 okay. No, I like this game. Okay. Um... <clears throat> it is. I'm gonna get Milo. Go for it. <laughs> so, uh, whatever he's doing, whoever he's watching at the moment, uh, he disappears, uh, and then he, and then he uh, appears on um, Blake's shoulder. Uh, takes the hat, jumps. <laughs> Can he do that? Yeah, I'm gonna say uh, <laughs> stealth or sleight of hand. Um, they are actively looking for what you're gonna try and do next. Um, but I'm gonna say roll advantage because they were not expecting that. Um, for Milo, for me, because I don't. Uh, really um, Milo. Whichever's better. Uh, probably me. I, I don't have Milo's stats. Amazing. What? Nice. No, what's that? Yeah, no, one's a natural one, so... Um, <clears throat> the other one is a ten. <laughs> you watch uh, as Milo appears. Um, uh, they are able to travel from you, because uh, like, they have to come to you, and you do not wait to appear with them with certain feet, so I guess yeah. they could land on the shoulder. They're able to just-in-time duck as Milo goes <laughs> grabbing, yeah. uh, and then goes splooshing <laughs> into the water and <laughs> yeah. the entirely. Uh, they look and follow Milo down. And they said, well, we might as well go and retrieve your friend. Um, and uh, I think it is uh, 60 foot. Um, so uh, they're going to cast this at oh, God. third level. Uh, and you watch as um, they uh, whip the winds around them. Uh, and you see uh, just around, just quite tight to the head, you see the winds spinning quite quickly. And you begin to feel it around yours, like your hair is moving a little bit and there's wind around your head. And they just give you a eyebrow raise, uh, and then they go flying down, um, chasing after where Milo landed in a river, and you just hear a swish as they um, go into the water. Do I know what's happened? Uh, not exactly, but they're not coming back up. Uh... You feel like the air around your yeah. This is it's weird, right? Yeah, it feels weird. Oh God. Okay. I can guess. <laughs> I'll do the you, same. I do not like this. I'm cold. It's cold. Uh, you push, your, your rest of your body is wet, um, but your head has this air bubble around it. Uh, they cast air bubble. At yeah. C can I have taken my uh, coat off? Because I don't want that to get wet. <laughs> you throw your coat off as you fly down. It lands on Garrett's head. <laughs> <laughs> uh, wow. Still paying rapt attention. Um, as you splush um, one layer of clothing less uh, than you were a moment ago um, yeah. into the water and you see Milo who's there just like looking up uh, Blake uh, who's like extending a hand down um, and looks up towards you um, and you see a underneath the river here you, because it's quite a large river and fresh water like runs fairly fast 
it's fairly clear, especially this time of year. So you can see quite far, you can see fish um, swimming alongside, like parting out of the way uh, as both you and Blake um, are in the water. You can see uh, river weeds sort of running at a sort of an angle and flowing in the water. It is uh, suddenly, well, not that it was too loud above, apart from the sort of the shouting of the various deckhands, but it is very serenely quiet down here. Cool. Can we talk? Um, <clears throat> fresh air. Uh, you breathe in the air of the air bubble around you, and um, yeah, it's not like you're um, as much as like a clear voice would be able to be heard. It's not like garbled speaking of being underwater, but the actual water itself acts as a buffer. So it's not perfect, but it's much more legible than if you were just trying to talk with a mouthful of water. Yeah. This is cool. I like to think so. Yeah, I mean, I'll just swim. Yeah. It's not like this fly doesn't quite help you here. It's a fly speed, not a swim speed. Yeah. Um, uh, the lake <laughs> seems a bit more at home uh, here under the water mm. um, than you do, particularly. Yeah, I'm not sure actually if I can swim or very basic. Yeah, it's, it's enough to, like, you very can, like, basic. you're able to propel yourself, but it's not, like, a, a learned, like, breaststroke swim kind of thing. I can't really swim very well. If Watch don't. this, and he just, he just he just shows you the pattern of what he's doing. <laughs> Try that. <laughs> cool. Um, he, he doesn't teach you to fully swim in this moment, yeah. but <laughs> at least you're able to, like, you know to, like, rather than just paddle and throw yourself, like, synchronous movement as much as possible. Um, um, he just points up, as in we should go up and mm, begin yeah, shifting up. Yeah, um, he brings himself over the edge uh, onto the ship. Uh, press the digitation, dries himself off, and when you land, he does the same thing to you. Cool. Uh, that we do other things, but. Um, I don't know what today will face and how much I want to. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> Just use all our spell slots on that. Um, spell slots? What's a. Oh, not spell slots. So, uh, yeah. I, I mean, spell slots. You describe it as much as like a. Yeah. As a, yeah so... You understand, like, oh, you, you, you have a certain amount of magic per day. It's like, yes, I found this as well. But when I. I need to rest after it. I, I, yeah. I don't, I've not met another. So I need. To, so it's for rest itself? That's. Good yeah, to it's know. like you, 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 you know, like your your body and your mind gets tired, but this is it's like something different. It's like your 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 energy gets tired, and you have to just like you have to sleep. You have to, you know, you have to rest that part of you as well. Makes sense. And what about the other thing where um, uh, the magic is um, magic changes? Like, um, uh, he goes to do the same lightning lure, and you see that they twist, and um, rather than lightning erupt, you see an arc of fire erupt um, from a hand and sends a whip towards something that isn't there. Would that be a different spell? Uh, make, or... make, an, make an arcana check. Uh... Nineteen? Nineteen. Do you think that's <clears throat> something uniquely sorcerous? Um... Mm. You remember learning about how like sorcerers can manipulate the magic in that way, but he doesn't know the difference. Yeah. Uh. Well, that's something that I can't do, but I think. Uh, that's a, an a, It's a thing that you could do. Uh, where you, we would like ch I've never played a sorcerer. I have no idea. Uh, you, <laughs> you, <laughs> uh, well, you can like change the spell. I guess. Okay. So that's. Uh... Me thing. That's what you think. This is beyond your obvious pleasant company. Uh, <laughs> it is good to actually speak to someone who knows what this is and can give me more information about my very nature. I don't think I've ever met anyone else either. Actually, Zebby, Garrick. No one else. <laughs> Fuck you guys. Nobody. 
I mean, apart from Garrick. <laughs> 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 this is different Garrick, who? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just... helping your mum <laughs> well okay yes okay I'm lying I'm not <laughs> I'm not lying on purpose I am yeah. not yeah. aware you've certainly never met a sorcerer before but you can... yeah there we go see fuck you guys <laughs> um, Zebby, the leader of Oz Nemesis, was a sorcerer. <laughs> I didn't really know him. Dawn. No, is a... a I can't remember. Dawn. Dawn was a what, one was a wizard. One yeah, Dawn was, was a... a wizard, um, and Dusk was a Eldritch Knight. Yes, but at the and moment, Harlan's at the, the moment, that, moment, in the last ten minutes, <laughs> I haven't met anybody else. <laughs> You feel the fly spell fade um, as that is done. Um, you say, I should make sure the sails are full and our course is correct. Not that we can go too far wrong uh, on a river. But all the same. Pleasure, Lady Diana. I hope we can do this again. Sure. And they go. You see they go to that same um, area dwarf, Miss Engel. Maybe Furbolg Dwarf? Um, uh, uh, as they go and make sure everything is ship shape. Um, and I would like for us to go to a break if that is okay with people. Um, yeah, there is something else I want to do. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. But yeah, cool. Such fun. Um, <laughs> okay. Yes, uh, we'll go for a break. It's quite um, the fluid, and that was that was quite that was quite wholesome. Isn't wasn't that amazing? Got a bit it was like a magic off, other, but you know it's fine. Huh? <laughs> Got a bit weird when they changed into each other, but yeah. Hey, that was. <laughs> awesome. never stops doing that. So. Oh Diana my god, you didn't stop. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So Diana's just walked off. Gareth's probably following him. <laughs> 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 we will resolve that. <laughs> <laughs> Please change back before they. <clears throat> yeah, if he does, I'm like, uh, like uh, <laughs> you just turn the corner and see the image of yourself kissing Garrick. <laughs> oh, man, that's kind of hot, though. Wholesomeness is gone. I'm like, let's uh, go to break <laughs> and have a cold shower. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, cool. I'll do that. Okay, we'll see you guys in a bit. <laughs> Bye. We will rise like the sun and we'll never run And we will fight, fight till we won We will bite, we will smite all through the night We'll never sleep, never rest Put the faith to the test, the self-obsessed Self-confessed, self-professed Divinity, nobility Your god is a fraud, so stop We're done With the violence and the fury and the cruelty said we're done we will win the war we'll win the fight the ends inside all you see in us is barbarian but all we want is to be equalitarian we will rock we will never stop standing on the top of the hilltop and we will mock viciously capriciously we're tired of assault and the bigotry You seem so full of wit and chivalry But when we knock at your door you'll break We're done We have fire in our veins And we will break these chains We're done We won't be ripped apart You will be burned and battle scarred We're tired of assault and bigotry 
tree and we'll stand and mock you viciously through music we captivate through songs and words we propagate we'll mock and smear and slander infiltration propaganda after years is finally resolution it's time to start the revolution we're done We will rise like the sun and we'll never run And we will fight, fight till we won We will bite, we will smite all through the night We'll never sleep, never rest Put the faith to the test, the self-obsessed Self-confessed, self-professed Divinity, nobility Your God is a fraud, so stop We're done With the violence and the fury and the cruelty Said we're done. We will win the war. We'll win the fight. The end's inside. All you see in us is barbarian. But all we want is to be equalitarian. And we will rock. We will never stop. Standing on the top of the hilltop. And we will mock. Viciously, capriciously, we're tired of assault and the bigotry. You seem so full of wit and chivalry, but when we knock at your door, you'll break. We're done. We have fire in our veins and we will break these chains. We're done. We won't be ripped apart, you will be burned and burned. Tired of salt and bigotry, we'll stand and mock you viciously. Through music we captivate, through songs and words we propagate. We'll mock and smear and slander, infiltration, propaganda. After years is finally resolution, it's time to start the revolution. We're done. We will rise like the sun and we'll never run And we will fight, fight till we won We will bite, we will smite all through the night We'll never sleep, never rest Put the faith to the test, the self-obsessed Self-confessed, self-professed Divinity, nobility Your God is a fraud, so stop We're done With the violence and the fury and the cruelty Said we're done. We will win the war. We'll win the fight. The end's inside. All you see in us is barbarian, but all we want is to be equalitarian. And we will rock. We will never stop. Standing on the top of the hilltop, and we will mock. Viciously, capriciously, we're tired of assault and the bigotry. You seem so full of wit and chivalry, but when we knock at your door, you'll break. We're done. We have fire in our veins and we will break these chains. We're done. We won't be ripped apart, you will be burned and burned. Tired of salt and bigotry, we'll stand and mock you viciously. Through music we captivate, through 
songs and words we propagate will mock and smear and slander infiltration propaganda after years is finally resolution it's time to start the revolution we're done We will rise like the sun and we'll never run And we will fight, fight till we won We will bite, we will smite all through the night We'll never sleep, never rest Put the faith to the test, the self-obsessed Self-confessed, self-professed Divinity, nobility Your God is a fraud, so stop We're done With the violence and the fury and the cruelty said we're done we will win the war we'll win the fight the ends inside all you see in us is barbarian but all we've won is to be equalitarian we will rock we will never stop standing on the top of the hilltop and we will mock viciously capriciously we're tired of assault and the bigotry you seem so full of wit and chivalry but when we knock at your door you'll break we're done we have fire in our veins and we will break these chains we're done we won't be ripped apart you will be burned and battle Tired of salt and bigotry, we'll stand and mock you viciously. Through music we captivate, through songs and words we propagate. We'll mock and smear and slander, infiltration, propaganda. After years is finally resolution, it's time to start the revolution. We're done. We will rise like the sun and we'll never run And we will fight, fight till we won We will bite, we will smite all through the night We'll never sleep, never rest Put the faith to the test, the self-obsessed Self-confessed, self-professed Divinity, nobility Your God is a fraud, so stop We're done With the violence and the fury and the cruelty said we're done we will win the war we'll win the fight the ends inside all you see in us is barbarian but all we've won is to be equalitarian and we will rock we will never stop standing on the top of the hilltop and we will mock viciously capriciously we're tired of assault and the bigotry you seem so full of wit and chivalry but when we knock at your door you'll break we're done we have fire in our veins and we will break these chains we're done we won't be ripped apart you will be burned and battle scarred we're tired of 
insult and bigotry We'll stand and mock you viciously Through music we captivate Through songs and words we propagate We'll mock and smear and slander Infiltration, propaganda After years is Hello everybody, welcome back to the Rapid Riders um, Last we left off a party uh, aboard the Drake headed uh, out to Drake. I'm talking about the Drake <laughs> headed um, um, out towards the ruins of the Towering Pass. Um, we have just had a magical demonstration uh, of the capabilities of the captain. Um, and we're going to reverse, not reverse, but rewind time just a little bit um, as uh, I said, Garrick and Texas were talking. Uh, and um, I just left a conversation um, with Diana and Ben. Garrick is like clearly watching the two of them as has had an eye on the captain uh, as you see the two of them jet up into the sky and I will take say take it from there. Okay. Wait for you to say something. <laughs> yeah, exactly. uh, I think this is about the point where he's just like I can go invisible and it lasts <laughs> since a bad situation, you know. I mean, what's just, you know, he's, he's, you know, he's, he's, he's good. I can appreciate a handsome looking man. But, you know. What do you think of our host? I mean, he's a captain of the ship, and okay, he is a bit good looking. I'm not going to lie about that. Uh, he's a flirty person by the looks of it. I feel like it's weird that you're asking me this as well. I'm just having a, you know, conversation. Uh, but I agree that sounds he's like called... a ghost. I mean, <laughs> at this point, uh, the two of them are, like turning into each other <laughs> at the top. Um, and then you see the lightning <laughs> like whip that away. It's like... Man's got magical talent and plenty to be, plenty to be, you know, jealousy and yeah. I mean, there's got to be a bit of envy there. I, mean, I worked a long time to be able to do what I can do, and he seems to have just figured this out. So that's a bit of a, you know, kick in the shins. But uh, and at this point, you see him go like splooshing over, and the captain's like throwing the, uh, Diana throwing her coat off, sorry, and landing on Karen. Uh, as they disappear into the water uh, for some time. Pick the coat up off him. Just, just, just like, you, you know, it's just, it's just, yeah, okay, fine. Yeah, fine. I, it's, yeah, fine. I'm jealous of a fella. He's very easy on the eyes. He's, he's clearly, yeah. He's something that I've not got and I know Diana wants, which is magic. And, you know, I've, I've got some, but... You've got some magic. I've got some magic, but um, yeah. I'm not going to deny the, the feather's got a lot more than me. I don't think Diana only cares about magic. No, I know that. I just... It's seeing something I know she really cares about is suddenly in front of her. And I... As does anyone know what happens when she sees something that is more important or more special to her, you know? I've, no I've not known Diana as long as you, but I don't think she would leave you behind. No, no, you're right. I'm just being a bit of... <sighs> Forgive way, me, I'm, I'm, I'm paranoid and I'm just in my own head a bit. You, you don't need to be paranoid. And by the way, he's just another showboaty idiot. Just he's kind of like you. <laughs> you're not wrong. Yeah. Thank you. What? Kind words. Hmm. I mean, 
right and kicking me out of my own head. I mean, it's not difficult. I'm pretty smart. I just don't pay much attention. <laughs> well, if you paid attention, you would see she cares about you. I can see she cares about you. He does like a, a shoulder bump to you kind of thing, like a, not a full hug, just a shoulder um, bump. Yeah. At this point, I think they are splashing out of the water. <laughs> uh, thank you. Right. Uh, he takes her coat over his arm and goes to, towards Diana. Uh, <laughs> as they're walking over, uh, hello. Highlight a hundred miles away. <laughs> <laughs> this is where it feels uh, like, bitch! <laughs> on top of a mountain. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> like a big gust of wind like just shakes a boat from over and nobody does. <laughs> Your voice carries. <laughs> Apparently so. Uh, that, that was it. Yeah. Yeah. Texas takes uh, a moment. Uh, looks at Diana, looks at Garrick and the captain, and then we'll just walk off in a different direction. Yeah. Uh, can, I, can we say that we're still at this, the top of the front of the ship? Yeah, yeah. Cool. And the, the forecastle there. Um, uh, he, he comes over with his, with my coat. Comes yeah. over with your coat, uh, briefly looks between the two of you, uh, roll a check. He does recall what happened. <laughs> Uh, and he's made, uh, he's going to make an insight check, just to be sure. He's pretty good with his insight, and he's a uh, do-elf. He's very good at his insight, and he walks over to uh, the you, uh, disguised as Captain Blake. Um, oh, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll drop it. Uh... Yeah. <clears throat> uh, and he hands you your coat. Oh, good, I'm cold. Puts that on. He he drapes it uh, around you, puts it on your thing. Uh, okay. And Captain Blake nods, um, and goes like through ship shape. Mm -hmm. uh, I'll kind of look at him. Uh, I assume he looks kind of jealous. I kind of know um, that he is. Make an insight check. I'm gonna... It, this will all fail if, if, if I don't, so I'm just gonna... It's a two. I'm gonna ignore it, because it's happening. <laughs> 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 you assume and do not like even try to like read his expression. You assume that he's still a, as he was yeah. um, on a two. Uh, as he just, I think all he does is sort of like hugs you and sort of looks out across the uh, the floor of the ship. I'd be like, Scarrick jealous, Mister Garrick braggart. Are you jealous? Mm. I'm Garrick and I'm just, I'm super flirty and I'm just really <laughs> just jealous all the time. Jealous all the time now, am I? Ah, uh, yeah. No, only when it's posh little captains <laughs> with sexy hats. <laughs> this is a very sexy hat and very jealous of his hat. I know. <laughs> I am very jealous. I am going to get him to make me fly at some point. Mm, it's very good. Mm, he looks like he's having fun. I'm glad. Yeah. Do you know what he can't do? What? Yeah, he leans in and kisses you. Ah. Uh, I will. I will kiss him back to the point where everybody watching feels really uncomfortable. <laughs> 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 As it like gets like to a point where people are comfortable, I uh, see Gary like raises an eye like a you and a kiss, uh, and you both go invisible. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we have sex right there in the middle of everybody. <laughs> it's really loud still. <laughs> if you don't like, if you lead, he doesn't stop you. I just not there. <laughs> I will sink this ship. Uh, I will. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to go, oh, young love, but no, what the fuck? 
no, we don't know. I don't know how far we go. Stop rolling for stuff. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fair enough. You don't know how far you go. Neither does anyone else. Um, at a certain point, you feel like the ship suddenly changed direction briefly. You feel oh. a wind like shit. <laughs> no, <laughs> um, I'll, I'll just, we'll just, we'll just, yeah, we'll make out for a bit. Um, yeah, you uh, and, you oh, just make out invisible. for a bit. Uh, uh, invisible. I hear whispering here. Yeah, just like, I trust you. Who knows? It's a very interesting man. Exactly. You yeah. feel one last uh, peck on your cheek, um, and then uh, they begin uh, walking away, and you feel the invisibility fade. Oh, well, I'm going to walk away. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> uh, yeah, if, you, if, you if you grab them, you can What grab them. time of day is it? Uh, afternoon, so probably about three, four. Okay, cool. Uh, that I was I was banking on him still being jealous. That was really frustrating when he had that conversation <laughs> with Daxus. <laughs> no, <laughs> he had a good conversation with a oh, friend, and you know what? We all need that sometimes. <laughs> damn it, I was hoping this is very good at talking. Oh not my good. god, I don't know what <laughs> to do now because my whole scene is just. <laughs> <gone>. <laughs> I was banking on him being mentally unstable. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was banking on some kind of. Interaction. <laughs> you got interaction. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, well I don't know. <laughs> While that whole flying thing was happening, taxes would have kept an eye on the captain. Can I do my insight thing <laughs> just to be like, mm. just to try and figure out? Absolutely. Especially is. watching them like go invisible. Uh, make an insight check. Uh, twenty-two. 22. Um, he's on a 22. You just with the initial insight check, it's definitely paying attention to them uh, as two other magic casters aboard. Um, definitely seems very uh, enamored. You don't think he's like romantically enamored so much as like, I finally have someone who can teach me something. Um, I would say that on a 22, that's what you get. Uh, are you using your feature? Okay, you spend a key point. Um, you uh, channel the magic of life that is the key. Um, and you um, intuit more about them. Can you read it uh, just for the stream as well? Can you read your feature there? Because I believe it's a homebrew feature. Yeah. So, a uh, homebrew feature. Um, after rolling for an insight check, you can spend a key point as a free action to distract the inner wants and feelings. At the end of this dis discretion, you learn the person's true feelings and thoughts, immediate, short or long-term wants, wants and feelings. Okay. Um, you, uh, learn a few things as you're sort of like, um, essentially like, channeling magic through him, it comes back and you sort of, it's almost like you washed it through him and you're reading back what it picked up, if that makes sense. Um, again, magic key, uh, more specifically. You, um, first of all, get a sense that there might be some kind of small kind of crush uh, developing um, with regards to Diana, um, but uh, that they have no intention of acting on that. Uh, um, you see uh, the immediate forethought is, yep, still to do with magic. This is fantastic. Um, um, I have not, there definitely seems to be some focus on Milo because familiars and that's something they've maybe heard of, but they've just seen a familiar maybe for the first time, uh, and no, and know it is a familiar. Um, uh, you gather searching deeper into what you extract, long-term wants and goals. They are, you, you feel the hatred that rests in them for the empire as this abstract, the empire. It is as strong in them as in, as you would expect it to be. Um, and I'm gonna say, 
Give me the 22 and long term, the desire to see the empire change, which is sort of what you discussed about how you would have to change rather than like, we can't expect to get rid of it entirely. You see that they have, there's some kind of vested interest there, something extra in that they don't want every human in the world to die. They just want um, the empire to change into something more fair. And the last bit of information I'll give you, uh, the certainly thing that catches your most attention, is that sort of vested interest in wanting the, the empire to be changed rather than destroyed. Um, seems to come from what you recognize as a familial kind of love, uh, rather than romantic or just general agape for all humankind. It's, it is a familial kind of love as though he has family in this empire. And you, I would say enough gather in this moment, but that family might be very vested in this empire. He does not want to see them. He certainly hates the Empire, uh, but he does not 100% hate his family. There's something fishy going on there. Okay. I respect that. <laughs> Very cool ability. Thank you, boy. <laughs> hey. Um, it goes on it is winter um so I will. sunset is not far off yep well sunset sunset's a great time mm -hmm. i like sunset the golden hour the golden hour um yeah i want to i want to i want to go uh watch the sunset with garrick okay Weirdly enough, Forecastle, still the best place to do it. Sun is setting in the west, um, and you are sailing directly west. Um, Requested so point... to do a Titanic moment. <laughs> <laughs> he holds you. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Does it feel like a fly? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Except I want. Never mind. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> already had that moment apparently <laughs> uh, yeah i i'm sorry about the whole captain blake thing kind of sorry if it made you feel bad i'm sorry i was jealous yeah well you know you have nothing to worry about Glad to hear it. And I promise you, you've got nothing to worry about. Mm-hmm, really? Okay. <laughs> Unless you'd like to. And he, he uh, nuzzles into your... Uh, <laughs> yeah. Good. Yeah. You're, you're, you're the one for me. I hate this kind of shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You're... You are my partner in crime. Sometimes literally. <laughs> yeah. Both wanted by the Empire for a large amount of money, so. Yeah, that's Always. true. Wow, yeah, no, it is actually very true. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 <clears throat> uh, so. I don't know. Have you, like, thought about what would actually happen if we were to, like, live past this rebellion? Remember what Zeke said to him. FYI. <laughs> it was a while ago, but... <laughs> yeah. Recap. <laughs> I can give you one if you want it. Please. I think I remember most of it. Uh, ba basically made you promise that if it 
starts to go pear shaped, that you'll go and make sure that you live a, a life rather than a fight. Also, give you a lot of money. A lot, lot of, of money. money. <coughs> that. Um, there's, there's also uh, a different offer that is there for Dewey, just as a reminder in case something happens. Don't forget to take it off my body. <laughs> uh, the, okay. the, the thing I couldn't I remember, remember did you say anything about not telling Diana where the money came from? I, I yeah, thought so that. You said. It, 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 He doesn't have to mention uh, the money at all. Yeah, he doesn't, he doesn't have to mention it, no. Yeah, yeah okay. Um, as you are standing there, they look... Uh, do you see that they are taking a beat to genuinely think about it? Might be difficult to get passage north, but even if we make this empire free, I don't think I have too many fond memories here. Stay long enough to make sure it's well taken care of, it's on the right path. Then I'd like to go somewhere else. Somewhere where it's not like. Uh oh. Oh, we've actually gone somewhere else. He went somewhere else. He went somewhere else. <laughs> ah, he's... <laughs> and he went somewhere else. He's just a bit. Um, like yes, those those cuts are so good. Like yeah. just the timing. <laughs> like. Dad, nothing's. I'm not pressing any buttons. Ugh, you mean like. Literally. Yeah. Get on a ship, go somewhere where it's never been a problem to be an elf. But... After we win, right? After like we win. After we make... Four? No. Like I said, we, I want to make sure this place is free. I want to put in the work to make it as good as possible for all the other races here. But part of me wants to do that and then go somewhere where people don't have to strain to remember that we're equal. Maybe see the world, and then once I've seen it all, if you on my side, we can decide where we like best. Well, I don't mind if, unless you're there, so. As long as you're yeah. there. That's what I meant. Hold you just a little closer. Sun. It's fully past the horizon. Hey, Garrick, do you want kids? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Good, neither do I, okay? <laughs> Um, cool. Uh, that feels like a scene. Um, it is now evening time, uh, just getting towards um, bed. Uh, ben, I know you have something. Uh, I know Bill has something as well, I think. <sighs> Can we go Perfect. drink with a crew? Yeah, there is a drink no, to be done. Oh, the lady. The one goes up high, right? Hooray and up she rises. Hooray and up she rises. Hooray and up she rises. Early in the morning. Ha! Let's go. Ah! If you're playing another gig, you are popular. Um, oh, yeah, I'll do that. Whee! Uh, yeah. Um, very, very easy to find yourself a, uh, a crowd. Uh, it will be a right down in the hold of the deck where the majority of the crew sleep and where Blake is sleeping currently. Um, nobody, like, if somebody wants to sleep, they are going to do it another night. Uh, people are having a good <laughs> night. Go <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go somewhere else. You can go somewhere else. There's still enough crew on deck to keep things running, to keep momentum. Um, Anchor is not dropped. Um, uh, but people are sort of... Um, yeah, they're, they're having a good time. Um, the so... Irish comes through in the sea shanties. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm going to say, as a party, um, do you think Halibut is put straight back in the brig once they're no longer working, 
Or are they invited? Ooh. It's your decision. If they are, I would like to have a conversation with them privately before they join everyone. I... Hmm. I guess taxes and Dewey are yay. No, oh I... yeah, of course. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Dewey's Dewey's yeah, I don't know. I I will, mm. I will. <clears throat> yeah, I will I'll I'll give him the chance, I guess. Okay. Some more begrudging leaving that's others. That's um, half of people. What is yeah. the, um, is that, is that what is that? Is that a yes I, or I no? think two yes and two begrudging yeses um see that how that is invited down. Um but um yeah, on the way down, I think you're stopped by two people. I'm gonna say because they asked for it first. Um, yeah, and have um uh Ben have a Yeah, yeah, go for it, Ben. Okay, uh, in that case I Ben. Can, I can meet him downstairs, uh, it's fine. Before that, who said I was invited? Um, I think the message gets passed <coughs> to you um by Oh, I mean, no, no one, ne no one necessarily like... has to say. He could just suddenly notice it's more no one's yeah. put yeah, it's him more back in the brig. Yeah. Immediately taken back to a brig. Yeah. Um, or unless, say, like, unless, unless you want, like, Diana would go and let you out or whatever. I mean, whatever. Uh, there's not much really to say unless you want to say anything, but it's like. Uh, I cut open the door to come and join. You see don't. him noticeably brighten up. <laughs> really? Yeah. Don't fuck it up. I'll do my utmost. Uh, she walks away. Just turns her back. And... May Dagwin join me? Oh, of course. She could always join. <laughs> Thank you. This will not be forget forgotten. From Pierre over her shoulder. Yep. You disappear down the way, and as you begin to sort of collect yourself ready uh, and turn, you see again small hallways of the ship. Uh, Zeke is there. Zeke, you see Dagwin as well. Um, God, first time we've seen each other since the whole. <laughs> since the... <laughs> Hello. Hi. Hi. Are you okay? Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna go and sing some she she shanties and drink a lot of rum and grog. You and go kill it like you usually do. Okay, cool, thanks. Uh, can I? I'm just gonna point at the two of them. Can I have a word with you two first? Talk about me and Dagwin. Out of character. Uh, yeah. Yes, of course. You don't know me. And I am very slow to change. I would like to apologize for what I did earlier. I reacted in a flight of fury that wasn't actually directed at you. More at... Ugh. More at the idea of what I thought you represent. Being a human with your fancy clothes and... But I have to remember that what we are literally doing is fighting for people, not for what they look like outright, that everyone is equal. And I apologize for judging you 
by the race of your birth, not by the character of who you are. Uh, I appreciate that quite a bit. Thank you. I. This does not mean that I trust you fully yet. Of course not. But and... I want to ensure that I am trying to be a better man. So I... May I ask a favor? Don't change too harshly. There aren't many people like me. And I do not want you to change. Just give me the opportunity to help. If if I'm allowed to. Of you course. don't know the person I was before this all started. The change has happened long before you arrived. Yes, but don't do it on my account is what I'm saying. Mm. You'd be lucky if I piss on you on your account, but uh, who knows? Maybe I'll begrudgingly make sure that you don't die someday. I mean, we're all going to die someday. But that means a lot. Thank you. I'll do my utmost. I'm just going to turn to Dagwin. I take it you were born here? Exactly no where I was born. I was made here. I know that you're likely to answer that you won't go anywhere without him and he without you. But just as a FYI, you're going to need a better mask than the one that he's got. You stand out far more than we do, and we're some of the most wanted people in the country. You kind of sparkle. Uh, look, looking at the gemstones on their back. Solid might, advice. Uh, Solid advice. And I'll take it underway. Go and enjoy yourselves. Thank you. Uh, do you leave? He's going to let you step past first. He's going to go up, up to the bridge. Oh, since you're staying here. Dagwin, I've given you as much freedom as, I'm, freedom as I'm able. You do not have to come with me on this journey. You can do whatever you wish. You do not have to potentially throw away your life. I like to have it now is for the better having you in it. Tears forming in his eyes. <laughs> I am Come on, old man. <laughs> Let's get a drink in you. I had like four sentences from this NPC. I would already die for her. <laughs> <laughs> You're calling old. You're older than me. <laughs> Who shows it better? Come on. Okay. <laughs> I don't trust her. <laughs> ah. uh, I follow Dagwin. Yeah, follows him away. Uh, before you get quite to, you can like hear the. Shanty's beginning of your room, Diana popping off. Um, uh, but I believe you encounter somebody else on the way. Oh, I'll, no, I'll, uh, with that as a scene, I, I'll do that once actually in in there. I'll have just gone okay, cool. with the rest uh, of the crew and, and meet them at a table or something later on. 
Uh, and I'll ask uh, Diana, you see them coming in. Does the music stop or slow down at all as they come in, or does it just. No, I know on? that they're coming in. So, like, I. Yeah. Well, I, uh, there's. No. Uh, it yeah. carries on. Nothing, nothing changes. Um, and I want to. Um, maybe at some point, I want to play dice. I'm proficient in the dice set. I want to play dice uh, and win some money off of these losers. <laughs> this crew that are giving us the decency of giving us a ride i want to take all of their, all money. their money no i want to take some of their money and then i wouldn't take all of his diamonds <laughs> uh, they were already taken away from me I'm you'll give careful. you can have them back for this purpose and then we'll take them away again <laughs> um I, I will say, his money. <laughs> uh, somebody else takes over playing and leading things for people who just want to sing and drink. Some people are beginning to like just fall, pass out from not like less for alcohol, more just they are so tired that they'll sleep three minutes anyway. Um, <laughs> there are people playing dice, um, and at your suggestion, you are an eloquent spot. Uh, it does not take any suggestion to hand this person back their diamonds um, <laughs> in order to um, <laughs> be be used as a way of winning them. Um, I'm going to say for dice, let's call this uh, your choice of wisdom or intelligence plus proficiency if you have proficiency in yeah, dice. There is fine. Um, oh, no, wait, intelligence. Are... <laughs> <coughs> uh, um, I would people. also like to use my sleight of hand to uh, make it so I win sometimes. We'll see what the roll is and then we'll, we'll see what the first one is. <laughs> um, we're just going to do this as a straight D20, adding uh, proficiency um, if you sort of you know the rules of the game really well. Plus intelligence of like, I know I should make this move, followed by this move, and then do this. Uh, um, uh, or wisdom of like, I've seen enough cheats to know that when I'm being when I'm being had and should like fold or bluff or that kind of thing. Yeah. It's not quite the same, you know what I mean? Yeah, liar's dice in it, Ben. That's what yeah. We, yeah. <laughs> liar's dice. We're not going to do a whole liar's yeah. dice, but we'll take another round. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I would also like if Dewey is around, I want Dewey to join in. And I, I will. Literally, I'll sit him down and I'll like you're playing yeah, dice. Playing. You're playing dice. Okay. Um, all right. Uh, oh. Does he have any money on him? I don't think he does. Uh, I mean, I would have taken <laughs> taxes has all take, of our money. Taken, I take it from all of the money. I would have Actually, taken yeah. it from taxes yeah. and I would <laughs> give him some pocket money. <laughs> pocket money. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody give me the... I opened my mouth to say it. You got this so quickly. <laughs> you get two uh, gold because it makes it even number for me. Oh wow! Okay, I was gonna say one, but uh, yeah, that two is good. Uh, and then you know, in in denominations, we'll put copper and silver. And uh, yeah, I'll, I'll I'll give Dewey some money. Um, cool. Be like, sit down, kid. We're gonna play. Uh, this is gonna uh, represent the the entire play, if that makes sense, rather yeah. than round by round. Um. <clears throat> um uh, somebody else give me a deck cannon. I'll say Stinky Michael joins. Um, Absolutely. And Sticky yeah. Pete does not. Sticky Pete, I don't trust Sticky Pete. Stingy bastard. <laughs> Might I suggest that Sam rolls a D100 on our bandit name generator? Ooh. Ooh. That sounds fun. Um, Yay. Right, well, let's roll that. That is 76. Garrett One Eye. Garrett One Eye. Perfect. He Does he actually eye. have one eye? He doesn't, no. and yet that's the scariest thing. <laughs> <laughs> He's got two he eyes. Three. Three. He's got no eyes. <laughs> Where's the other one? <laughs> Play just too lazy to <laughs> Do you want another one? No, he, has, uh, uh, he does indeed have one eye. Um. You have one covered in a patch, much like yours. Um, yeah. I'm just a pirate. I did bit less fancy. Make a pirate. You are a pirate. <laughs> You're I mean, to make a pirate. A character. pirate. <laughs> You're a pirate. He's like, I got no money, but I'll play for your patch. That's a fancy looking patch. <laughs> I'll give you mine as ante. <laughs> but I can just give you money to play. Do I look like a charity case to you, boy? Oh. And put your diamonds and your patch in the middle and let's roll some dice. Take his patch off. Oh, what do we see into the patch? Um, what do we he see? has his eye closed. He has just had his eye closed. Uh, you, yeah. If you want to roll an inside check, or... <laughs> no. 
perception? No. Oh my god, it's weird to see with two eyes. Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Uh, <laughs> Garrett, one eye takes bears off. They did not have their eyes closed. Uh, you <laughs> see... Um, ah. Oh, literally you, look, you see oh weird looking scars and a socket that is very empty. Uh, you don't see bone, it's healed. Um, anybody can make a check if they wish to try and figure out what kind of thing made those scars, uh, but otherwise they get to roll in dice. Um, oh. So this is a d20 plus proficiency if you're proficient in dice, um, plus your wisdom or intelligence modifier. Stinky Michael is not too clever. But luck is on their side. Um, they get a straight intelligence. Uh, straight intelligence, or oh, intelligence plus your proficiency if you are proficient in dice, yeah. uh, or wisdom plus proficiency if you wish to do that instead. Intelligence. Um, I'm not wisdom, intelligence. Same. I mm. ugh, Phil, did you get a natural twenty? Because I will. T- ugh, God damn it. Uh, you. Uh, uh, Garrett, when I get a nine overall, um, Stinky Michael gets a solid sixteen. Um, uh, oh, really? Yeah, the, the boy doesn't. Uh, I got a twenty-six. I'm so glad. I did. <laughs> this is... Holy shit! Mm-hmm. And the natural one for Dewey, the first time you've ever gambled, and you immediately do that. It's oh, just, God. Like, you can, like, you guys will see him like playing the game not too badly, but. He has the worst luck on his dice every single time. There's, there's, there, there cannot be intelligence behind that play because he's got nothing God to stop. Um, God damn it, Dewey. Young, <laughs> may I see your dice? No. What? Yeah, I'm that... teaching him, God damn it. <laughs> Why, what's he doing? Go on, do it. He just, roll, he just rolls it to see if they're broken or <laughs> rigged in any way. They're not broken. <laughs> When you roll them and switch uh, at some point during the game, they will perfectly find out of your hand. It's just not bad <laughs> The boy is cursed, I tell you. <laughs> All right, Sticky Pete, you're not even in this game. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not Sticky Pete, I won't go. You think we all sound alike, lad. And you. What do you mean there's only one pirate accent? And they are. <laughs> Um, um, Stinky Michael uh, is, I believe, the last person. No, uh, it comes down to Stinky Michael, uh, <laughs> Stinky Michael, Halibut, uh, and um, Diana. And in one fell swoop, Diana takes uh, the pot. Um, oh, I didn't even. Round. I didn't even have to cheat. Oh man. <laughs> what do you mean? What do you mean? I didn't. didn't I didn't. <laughs> Say that out loud? <laughs> no. Okay. Uh, but I will teach. I will teach Dewey though. Um, yeah. uh, you begin teaching them how yeah. to. Yeah. So like. Have to play and then the strategies is yeah. Yeah. So like away from everybody, like it quietly. I say mm-hmm. if you have a role like that again, just do this, and then I will like. It's kind of like a, blink. <laughs> very like very little uh, little <laughs> with your. You know? I, uh, I I apologize. I thought you were teaching him how to play a game. You were instead teaching him to cheat. That is, I uh, <laughs> that's <laughs> there. We are. That's fine. Why? What? Uh, <laughs> okay. Um, Makes no difference okay. to me. <laughs> well, I'll teach him how to play as well. But if he has roles like that, he needs to. He needs are you, to are you open with me that that is like the the things you're teaching me are not. Or are you just teaching me as if that's part of how you play the game? Um, no, I, mm, no, I'm a bit like, um, I don't know, how. what would I say? Like, um, n- matter of... <laughs> just think they're playing it the way they're meant to play <laughs> The, all the bouncers at the uh, in the casino are okay, like... the number you want, right? I pick 20 every time. I don't know why everybody doesn't do that. No, I I will, uh, I'll like I'll teach you how to play, and then I'll be like, okay, so there's another thing that <laughs> sometimes people like me do uh, when we get really bad numbers like you did. Uh, you just 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 without anybody seeing you, because it's not 
a good thing to do. Uh, it's, it's a bit naughty. Just do the... <laughs> What do you what do you mean by naughty? Uh well, like, you know, it makes it fun for us. You need if you need money, do you Are you, are are you, you wanna allowed win? To, are you allowed to do it? Well <laughs> meh. No, not in the not in the rules of the game, but like Work with me, man. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, are you trying to convince him that it's that it's not? Are you trying to avoid the concept that it's cheating? <laughs> because well, I, I I know what I want to happen. <laughs> are you doing an inside check? That's yes. Okay. <laughs> that's, that's where I want this to go because I know it'll have hilarious consequences. <laughs> uh, I was like, well, okay, I'll be like, well, I uh. I'm I'm not using the word cheating. I'm just <laughs> it's it, if you want the game to go your way, bending the rules. It's it's not cheating. It's adapting. Manipulating the odds in your favor. Exactly. You have advantage on this post your two health heritage. Actually. Um, I see. I've foreseen this, and he gets a two. Oh, you just you use your portable <laughs> and they get a two on their insight. Uh, what's what do you add to insight? <laughs> Um, that's yeah, the first that time I've used it. Could have five. used it on somebody else's dice roll. Nope. <laughs> nope. Uh, five. So, yeah, that, that makes a five. Silly, they are explaining the rules as they are meant to be said. And, um, that is exactly what I wanted. But you to know happen. that when you think back to this conversation later, uh, I will say, Diana, you have said it in such a way and you have used a important role, but you know when he is caught out of this later, he will look back and he will, he will not think that you were intentionally misleading him. Good. Um, no, he will, I, think, it's... he will think he misunderstood. Oh. Surely he kn like I don't know. Surely he knows. Uh, yep. he, yeah, no? you can't okay. get back in it now. <laughs> it's it's happening. <laughs> Let's um... play another game. <laughs> can do another game, Sean. Uh, With his you new... know, two two more D hundreds if that's okay as well. Get two more players from. Do I have to put my diamonds up, or do, can I just use gold? I would personally like a diamond, but that's fine. Whatever. <laughs> I, not to be that guy, but there's not <laughs> enough gold on this. Not enough gold in this ship to be worth one of my old diamonds. Put the fucking diamonds in. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> fucking pretend prick. Jesus Christ. Who is <laughs> <laughs> oh, <this> guy? <laughs> <laughs> Um, you don't have uh, to say it out loud. Um, All right. I would say two things. First of all, it was a 35 and a 61. 35? Uh, or a D100? Is the, no. the, the, the name of the pirates. All right, 35. <laughs> um, Ali, the heister. Is that an A-L-I? Uh, as in Alton, watch that one. A-L-L-Y. A-L-L-Y, the, the heister. The heister. Oh, no, I don't like this one. Uh, what's the other number? That was 61 and 35 for the two. 61. Holy shit. We've had one eye, and now we have three-eyed Eric. Three-eyed Eric. Woo! <laughs> we yes. now know where the other <laughs> eye, eye <laughs> went. <Sorry. laughs> has he just got, like, an eye patch in the middle of his forehead? <laughs> no. Um, no. He really has... It's morbid, uh, but as he sits Gaffer down, uh, let's gaffer tape more strong than a leather cord. Yes. <laughs> Is that um, what's his name, oh, I? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Did you win in and dice? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Um, nice. You see other like, members of the crew look around. Um, <laughs> okay. uh, just so I know, like, Dewey is good at sleight of hand, right? We'll see. Okay, <laughs> and I would make sure it's it's a you gotta you gotta keep it secret, okay? You got this. Slap on the back. Let's go. <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> only sorry, only if it's not going your way. You, Last you, resort. You, you, Last resort. You've just you've done basically what you've just done is you've just taught him how to play shamel hummel. Yeah. 
<laughs> yeah, pretty much. And you it's get a game where you, where you actively lie to each other. Yeah. I'd be like, last resort, okay? If you get another starting one, you do this. Okay. Uh, I'm going to say uh, Ali the Heister. Uh, uh, first of all, uh, Free Eric looks at the pot uh, and says, I would also like his eye patch. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have it anymore. I'm asking her. Oh. <laughs> what? I want both of her eye patches. You just won that in the last pot, so it's up to oh, you. Oh, I did. Oh, sh- oh, sure. I bought. I won both. Yeah. Oh, sure. I'll put them in. Yeah. <laughs> you put them in. Um, you see, Ali the heister. Uh, this uh, feminine looks uh, half elf. Do you think half earth elf? Half human um, uh, looks at the pot, uh, picks up one of your diamonds uh, uh, carefully. <clears throat> um, you see a look across their face. Uh, you think they have noticed something about the nature of these diamonds, um, Halibut. The rest of you can see that there's a look of puzzlement on their face, but they then put it down saying, Well, they're real. Of course they are. Uh oh. God. Okay. And they put forward like uh, gold pieces. Something. All they have to match, basically. Um, and we can all roll. I want to remember oh, so shit. much in my life. Oh. Just. <clears throat> um. Did you have to cheat, Phil? <laughs> yeah, I I rolled a five. Fun. So I, would, fucking so I would like to do that thing that you're perfectly allowed to do no. if things aren't going your way. Yeah. I mm-hmm. make that... a slight of hand check because okay. you know that you need to be subtle about it. It's part of the game. <laughs> I don't want any middle numbers. I don't want to succeed perfectly or fail. Uh, uh, I've already I've <laughs> already oh <laughs> Oh no! Can I use a can I use a, <laughs> can I use a, can I use a, can I use a is it really shit if I use another pull tense on this? Oh uh, my god! Let's see if you notice. What did you roll? Is that a natural one? Oh. It's not a natural one. Oh. It is. Now I want to use a. Oh, fuck. Oh, is it it's a four. four. It's a four. It's a oh. four. So, so did, you, did, you, did you want to roll it, or can I have said that? Because I was gonna. Do it. I was. I will say that is enough that everybody notices. But you probably <laughs> sat next to Dewey notice before anybody else. Um, you you can basically they flipped it and people are noticing. Um, you can use your you can use your portion because you can see this. Yeah. You need to be able to see it happening, and you certainly it see it happening, happening if no other people can see it. Yeah. Oh uh, yeah. So he's got a sixteen. You got a 16 instead. Um, you just sort of catch it out of the corner of 20, your eye. 20, 23. Um, you <laughs> stamp uh, a little bit on the floor, and you can see in far of the corner one of the planks that just needed that extra little bit, which you saw happening this morning in one of your visions, um, just burst open, and everybody turns to look at it. Uh, as you see, that um, half dwarf, half furball goes, Who repelled the bloody hold? And they go over and they just grab some nails and they start hammering and fixing it. Enough of a distraction when nobody notices Dewey's sight of hand. Uh, Check, because you knew how um, that was going to happen. You knew how that was going to go. Um, um, You see... Does he he roll again or what what happened? This this happens like over the course. This is like one of the deciding Uh, rounds, if that makes sense. Um, (laughs) Bad luck. Um, uh, What do people get on their dice rolls for for the the dice game? Um, 13. 13. Uh, You are out fairly early on. 24. 24. Uh, You... It is a bit more of a, a... battle ongoing. Um, you can see that both of you have played dice before. Uh, Ali the Heist is smart, uh, and she um, does not take unnecessary risks. Um, uh, oh, Free Eyes is... Uh, Free Eyed Eric is uh, out next, um, but by no means did he go out like a chump. He knew how to play the game, uh, even if he couldn't think very 
a uh, few moves ahead. Um, it comes to that point where it is you, Ali, and Dewey, and that is where um, the distraction happens. Um, Ali looks around and realizes that Dewey has knocked her out and looks up at the two of you and sort of uh, nods her head uh, and um, folds her arm back from the table uh, as it's between the two of you. Dewey, um, what is your maximum that you could get? If you rolled a natural 20, what's the maximum you could get? For, oh, what, dice, for um for the dice for game, yeah. Um, uh, is you said it's uh, intelligence it's... or wisdom, yeah? Yes, yeah. So it'd be tw- uh, twenty three if I use wisdom. So even maximum you could roll wouldn't be the twenty four. Yeah. Um, you know, <laughs> I, I, I I'm trying to think if this is like a would you know that if you cheat that obviously it's going to be obvious. I don't know. I guess. Can I cheat the other way? Yeah, uh, roll, a, roll a sleight of hand check. <laughs> What'd you get? No, Two. I got uh, <laughs> uh, eight. Uh, eight. <laughs> eight. Um, everybody at the table um, sees like the final dice roll and they like see either side. It's like you're sort of shielding it from each other, this liar's dice way. They see that you've like got like the winning dice, you've got the luck of it. And watch you quite clearly <laughs> fumble your dice into being much worse as everybody sort of like looks around at you, like for a signal of what? <laughs> this is the first time. Uh... <laughs> Dewey, you you win. Is that that's it? I, I, have I got it? Yeah. Congratulations. Hey. Oh wow. Hey. Have some fun. Oh. Yeah. Finally got a hang of the game. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) You feel like a quite like a loud slap on your back uh, as you see um, as you see Garrett one I go. Congratulations, young master. Well done. That's an excellent play, especially for a new beginner. Now, if we might talk about my eye patch that you have. <laughs> <laughs> and you hear you'll never slap as you see free eyed Eric. <laughs> Let's also talk about that eye patch because I've been quite. No, he was, he was a bit more sinister. When he, Let's also talk about that eye patch because I was quite interested in, in it. It's my fucking eye. You have my eye. You're, you've got uh, it. Uh, like, I'll uh, get it. I'll get it between them. Like, yeah. I'll... <laughs> Places it on the table and just takes really awkward steps back. As you take awkward steps back, there's been enough drink for the two of them, like, stare at each other. Go for it, initially become friendly, and then go into a full arm wrestle going back and forth. <laughs> uh, you watch uh, as one eye, Garrett one eye pins um, um, Eric, uh... <laughs> free eyed Eric, <laughs> uh, grabs his iPad back, picks it up firmly, um, and in the same move, uh, grabs the eye patch of uh, one halibut Tyree and tosses it back to Halibut. Yes. I'm going to win that off your fair and square one day. Thank you. I was just going to grab my spare off my back, but thank you. <laughs> yes, Dewey's to give back. Oh. <laughs> Dewey's to give back. I just give it back to Dewey. He won it fair and square. But the sentiment is appreciated. I need it. As I reach the investor. As I reach into uh, Dagwin's backpack and pull out a spare eye patch and put it on, <laughs> it looks yeah, exactly Dag- the same Dagwin's as the eye patch bag ready for you. It's not the first time. Guys, the first time bag. It's a, a separate pouch pack. and everything. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> He's a pretentious prick. Jeez. Uh, slap Dewey on the back. I'm like, very proud of you, bud. Um, yeah, that's. I mean, I. I mean, I'm not 100 percent on what actually happened, but that was that was that was fun. Yeah, just be more, way more discreet next time you decide to change your dice. Okay. Discreet? I mean... Yeah, like, really discreet. Like, like you're not... Yeah, just really discreet. And don't tell anyone you're ever doing it. Have some okay. rum. <laughs> okay, it takes a tot of rum. <laughs> Make sure he <laughs> drinks the goddamn oh. rum. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the revelry continues uh, late into the night. Uh, at some point, you see Captain Blake come down, um, having. Um, you probably all felt a shift as this ship suddenly slowed down before they came down. Um, 
enjoys drinks as well, um, but uh, sleeps ready to command the ship in the morning. People, it's wrapping up at this point. Somebody like starts to sing a song, and people go like, ah, and they just. Uh, people are beginning to wind down. It's conversational sort of noise, but not like a loud raucous music. Um, I'll, sl- I'll slow it down on the. Yeah, you just go like go slow, qu- quiet guitar. Um, you see some people are just passing out where they are sat. Um, uh, you see, uh, I'm gonna say you see Ali, the heister, talking to Captain Blake. Uh, at one point, uh, just with a, a nod uh, as Blake um, uh, sort of has a quick look over in Halibut's direction. Uh, and then uh, Halibut's looking at it. Ali the Heist. <laughs> <laughs> Ali the Heist is looking at you. I want to know what's happening. Mm. 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 Try to do an insight to see what they're, or try and rip lip read what they're whispering. Do you have your can feet? you do that? I can read. Yes. <laughs> oh wow. I don't know. <laughs> you see, uh, sort of. Yeah, you see. Um, I, I says captain, and like just a little bit of uh, Ali, uh, and this, yeah. Um, the diamonds that the prisoner. I don't know if that's what they're still calling them. I just thought I should let you know that they're not naturally formed. The diamonds, um, but they're no, not like diamonds I've seen before. They've not been cracked from the rock. I don't know what they are, but that's the extent of it. Hmm. Thank you. Uh, thank you very much, mate. I will. I'll let our friends know. Seems thank you. Uh, that's how the conversation ends. Never fail to discuss over chess. <laughs> yeah, I will. Uh, yeah, I, <laughs> I, I will see like the, the hushed conversation. I don't know what's happening, so I can go and go and dance with Blake. So he might tell me. <laughs> that's the <laughs> only reason in this situation why I would want Are to dance with the second <laughs> cat. <laughs> Yeah, Blake <laughs> uh, uh, dances with you. Uh, nope. Uh oh. Nope. Don't like that. Don't like that. Captain's lightweight. He just passes out. Yeah. Immediately after the long drink. <laughs> Absolutely. Um, <laughs> Blake again. Yep. Damn. Blake. And you come to my bed chamber, so it's so late. <laughs> You're like still I, amongst the crew. I was like, I've, I've, I've been here for, I've been here for hours. <laughs> like he's, make, he's, make, he's making a bad joke. <laughs> I know, and I'm like, I've, like I've, I've been here for hours. <laughs> been here longer oh, than you. Waiting have. so long. I'm sorry to keep you. Mm, he's You're tired, late. Probably. You're <laughs> late. He's going sloppy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh wow. Yeah. You're you're late. Are you drunk? <laughs> Or are you I'm... just tired? Half of, uh, what's it? Six of one, half a dozen of the other. Yeah, I'll pretend I know what that means. Um. Bit of both. Oh, right. Cool. Cool. Uh. I'll, I'll, I'll dance and does he t- tell me about the... He doesn't mention it. Damn it. Although you, I don't know if Tax has mentioned it to you yet. No, 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 she wouldn't have. No. Uh, he doesn't mention it as you dance. Is it too mad a gamey if I say, what, what was that about diamonds? No, you, could, you, you, you saw Ali talking to him. Uh, you yeah. don't know if it's about the diamonds, but you did notice that, that Ali was surprised at the diamonds earlier, or something was registering about it. And you definitely saw them look towards Halibut um, during the conversation. Um, so certainly you can press on what was Ali talking about, about Halibut. Is that about the diamonds? Um, yeah, yes. She said something. Um, 
didn't seem like they've been mined or naturally made. Odd, considering how tiring. Yes. Actually, yeah. It's starting to end. Well, there you are. Perhaps it's just a very unusual cut. Although, like, Ali has quite a mind for things mm. of value. Yeah, okay. Okay. Cool. Yes. That's it. Dave? That's it. Yeah. Um, just that's it. And then goes to a dance. Uh, the man has been much like you on your feet, on his feet, um, much of the day, channeling the winds. Um, and as graciously as they can, uh, take their leave to sleep. And yeah, people are. Well, if genuinely... we're, we are genuinely in their bedroom, Yeah, you are. Yeah. Yeah, this is in the, the lower deck where, like, okay, there are well, lots of hammocks around here and some yeah. dead rocks. Well, at that floor. point, um, I'll be like, they'll stop the music and everything will stop and be like, bedtime. Uh, yeah. <laughs> like, agreeing with you. Bed, bed, bed. Uh, uh, he needs to go back in the cells. Does somebody want to take the uh, Dewey, is it? Someone will take him. Uh, um, yeah. Cool. Yeah. So yeah. So uh, Dagwen, uh, Dewey, and how to uh, make her way. And Milo. Down. And Milo. <laughs> <laughs> um. Take him for protection. Uh, the doors presumably are locked on the brig. Um. Anything else you wish to say before yeah. heading back to the Yeah, I'd, um, I'd uh, just sort of say to Halibut um, before he's, he's come in and just be like, Hey, um, uh, kind of glad that you got to be out with the crew, I guess, uh, uh, <laughs> earlier on. Just, um, yeah, see, I've like um thanks to Diana I've been like managed to get in touch with with Colleen and um uh obviously we wanted to try and you, you can understand we 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 it's it's going to be difficult for us to to trust people so we wanted to find out about what was going on and like my initial worry was if something had happened to her but she she said that she said good things, you know. Um, so, as far as I go, like that—that's—that's that's good enough. Her word is good enough for me. Um, just bear bear with the the rest of them, okay? They, I've been I've been very lucky in in my in my life of oppression. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh. Where where I was, I got to, I was I was made to s spend all my time in the the manor grounds, so I, I didn't, I was in contact with my human masters f less, so mm. therefore there was less time to be, yeah, these these the rest of them have have, have seen worse things, and. I guess the stuff that they've been through has, has made them mistrusting to protect themselves and, and the rest of us. Mm -hmm. Just bear with them, they're gonna they're gonna they're they're not gonna be nice to you for, for a while. Um but I, I do not expect them to. And don't get me wrong, I do not uh, I don't believe I wouldn't trust me either. What uh, my kind of done is unforgivable. I just hope they can look past that enough for, to allow me to help. It's, it's that difficult thing we can't yes. trust. We can't trust too easily, or we'll be we'll be wiped out or right back where we started. But if we don't learn to to trust, then people with your intentions uh, might not get through. Um, 
yeah. But once 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 these guys you know, if, if Colleen's right about you once once we get to see that, um you wouldn't you wouldn't want better people to have your back. Yes. She's quite a remarkable, re remarkable young woman, Colleen. Um, uh, Halite, uh, oh, sorry, Halite, fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> you, you chose the same first syllable yeah, you for your next character. Yeah. yeah, I did. <laughs> I thought it was going to be a funny joke. It's coming back to bite me. Uh, <laughs> uh, Halibut gets down on only, he, he struggles a little bit, okay, on, on me, one, 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 it's been a, a long day. He looks at you. On the, on your level, eye to eye. I she's a remarkable young woman. I, I I promise you, I do not intend or ever will harm a single hair on her head. She's quite special. Right, Jack. That's a, I go I go on eye level. I go on eye level for it. Advantage for that, even if it's yeah. only one eye. <laughs> so check uh, and only half a soul. Sorry. How about make uh, the appropriate charisma check? Oh yeah, right. I can do that. <sighs> that is a seventeen. Off to 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 twenty. Yay! It's completely honest. Yay! It was persuasion I rolled. <laughs> yeah, so you'd like, so you, you, that's what, that's what you would say. Um, yeah, because you got higher on your headset. <laughs> yeah, you know, yeah. That's how it works. You, yeah, you, went, yeah. you know, I tried <laughs> to persuade you that I wouldn't hurt her. Because <laughs> um, I wouldn't. <laughs> as far as you know, I guess. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's good to know. Right. They, they, it, oh, yeah, I guess you know, they're going to say more convincing than that. And, like I, said, they, they, like I said, you wouldn't want you wouldn't want better people to have your back. I mean, like they'll still be assholes, but mm. um, um, actually, no, it's Dewey. He would say they'll they'll still be buttholes, but they... <laughs> Milo um, nods. This reminds me of someone. I look past Dewey to back with Cage. <laughs> so, um, so, <laughs> so, and I'll I'll look to Dagwin and be like, so, so Dagwin, how? How have you, how have you survived in all this? In the, in the middle, in the middle of the empire, I, I like is, is that is that where Cla um, House Tyree is based? Ba basically, in the same, it's like almost yeah, as yeah. close as you can be. Yeah, we're like almost the, like the second city closest to Vinin. <laughs> Hampstead, how... right? Yeah, yeah. Next to like Harling's Rest. I guess uh, so, also Vinin as well. So you asked how she survived. Yeah, how have you how have you managed to to to, to be, I guess, in, in, in this world? Funny. Um my answer to that used to be bad luck. Uh now hard work and the right people and knowing friend from foe and taking the right risks. As she says taking the right risks, she's looking directly at Halibut. Okay, maybe less of a bottle than I thought. <laughs> <laughs> Halibut says that. <laughs> uh, Still a dick. Does... Yeah, there we go. There we are. <laughs> does she... Does she, what kind of feelings does she have towards him? Uh, I've been watching through Milo the whole time, <laughs> yeah. obviously. You can make an insect. Right? <laughs> obviously, I'm there. This <laughs> way, in hand. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Garrett, like next to you, going, "What's she saying? What's she saying?" <laughs> I know. Say oh it. my god! <laughs> Everybody, do that. that. What? <laughs> Yeah. Garrett's next to you, like, <laughs> just tender hooks. Um, uh, I, I got a 13. Do I have 14? <laughs> um, Inside. You've seen a familiar look on her face of um, a very protective nature. Um, yeah. There is some kind of... <clears throat> it's, it's less of a... 
I am a knight, and you are my charge. There is a certainly some kind of at least familial kind of yeah of appreciation there. I want to um, know if it's more than familial, and I will be watching. On that role, you can't I, yeah, I will be watching for however, like for now, from now on, yeah. forever. <laughs> To get this answer. <laughs> Good to know. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know the relationship. No. He just she seems to like him a lot. I know they like sisters sister. and stuff. I know they're sisters and stuff, but like I don't. I'll relay it back to Carrie. <laughs> <laughs> um, you're like, your eyes and ears are in Milo. You just feel a squeeze on your shoulders and real. Ah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Garrick's like, thank God, I thought you were having another seizure. Um, <laughs> <laughs> another one. <laughs> another She's one. She's actually had a seizure at some point in the past, <laughs> confirmed. One day with enough instance, Garrick's going to get familiar. <laughs> it's going to happen. Fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> you made have both little like monkeys. <laughs> Does he not have any insects? You have it at the moment. Does he have five familiar? Uh, you know it, and you're both. He's able to learn. Uh, I need to check uh, what our interests can do there. But regardless. Oh, right, okay, okay, okay. You could teach it to him. I could. Um. Any, I know it's sort of, uh, we're mid conversation. Yep. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> so, 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 I don't want to suddenly, and we move on. Like, nope, it we, was we, very we, important, <laughs> but yeah. <laughs> no, it's fine. Um, <laughs> any more shipping on this ship going to happen? Yeah. <laughs> it's the place to do it. Yeah. yeah. Um, but yeah, that, that's 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 kind of the, the major point is that, that, uh, that Dewey was kind of looking for. He's like, okay, well. So I will hopefully by the time we get to the winding paths we won't I won't be doing this and I'll like lock the You're headed towards the winding paths. That's why I thought you were. Uh, yeah, do we do we like <laughs> mid like mid turning the key is like My lord just be like ah! <laughs> hit him in the face. <laughs> and then I'll I presume, I presume and so I'll... that way. I'll finish, and then I'll finish locking. And I was like, "Well, I mean, you're gonna find you find out when we get there." Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I thought you might be heading had... there. Fuck's Good to know. You're quite remarkable friends, Dewey. Ah, Habit does not say Dewey. Young Fairfoot. Yeah. Um, I just hope they become mine at some point as well. Maybe not even that close, maybe. Colleagues. Give it, give it just give it time. Like give them time. A uh, a lot of time. I mean I don't know. I mean has has Zeke already had like a gruff dad chat with you? <laughs> There was no like no conversation I had with my father. No, but, but like, it was <laughs> okay. yeah, Good but yeah, yeah, okay. <laughs> I feel like he probably would have had that at some point, or he will in the near future. Um, yeah, uh, he's he's a he's a ve he's a very he's a very crispy on the outside marshmallow sometimes. Um, but... Zeke being <laughs> the uh, dwarven. No. Yes. Yeah. None of you have introduced yourselves, so I am, I'm piecing it together with subtle oh, hints and clues. Okay. So my okay. my apologies. That is your right to keep your names. It's just oh I'm okay. Trying. Well, um, other than taxes, obviously. But again, I don't think it's your real name. <laughs> he yeah. says under his breath. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, just very very good with figures and organizing things. Um. Yeah, and and also um, and also surprisingly good at killing things. As Poking well. him. She's, She's also the is... dragon chest. <laughs> Milo is poking me. <laughs> poking him in the cheek. Yeah. The magic monkey does not seem 
<clears throat> that you had does not like to seem does not seem to like you having such a big conversation with me. Maybe you should I... stop. Monkey, please. Uh, just. <laughs> what is it? It's a magical monkey. I know that. I saw it disappear. Uh, I don't tell me. Don't tell me. I saw the monkey go. It's. Yeah, I mean, it's it's. Yeah. Don't don't you don't need to tell me any. It's it's fine. It's fine. All right. Um. Anyway, I'm I'm looking forward to getting to know you guys. So um, I'll see you in the Likewise. morning. Likewise. Likewise. See you in the morning. Enjoy your diamonds. Uh, oh, yeah. And then I'll be like, I really want. I, I know. I know. I I know. Fuck. I want it fair and square, but. Yeah, I know. I know. It. Sorry, <laughs> Dewey would do this. Like, mm -hmm. it's not. Why would he need an eye patch covered in diamonds? <laughs> Sorry. No, it's it's. Di it, you, you you actually won some diamonds as well. Oh, I did win. Yo, yeah, yeah, I win some diamonds. The reason okay, why Diana that... wanted to play with. <laughs> yeah. No, in that yeah, in that case, the, like, but the eye patch. Okay, but not the diamonds. Like, no. Good. No, no, that's fine. Yeah, was, <laughs> the diamonds. Was, that was. That was the gambling, but he like Dewey would have just found it a bit odd that someone would would use that as as, as <laughs> especially the dude that put the, the one that was just an eye patch in because that's just weird. Um, it's quite quite strange. A lot of um, weird, uh, interesting characters on this book. Yeah. Um. Uh, there is there is one thing that that does. That makes even it makes even me a little bit nervous, I guess, is and like I'm still like holding the the eye patch. Like like your your from your family is is like is based around this. Like they're one of the world they're incredibly wealthy, right? Correct. Okay. That, I guess I mean that that's gonna come with advantages. Like we it's really difficult for us to to get into population centers and and things like that. I mean, normally it's basically Diana and taxes go in, and it's a, it's a, like a, a sitcom. I don't know what a sitcom is. I'm in a medieval fantasy world, but yeah. <laughs> I've seen plays titled like that. Yes, yeah. That's yeah, okay. Um, <laughs> but um, that that could be amazing. That could get us into some amazing places but at the same time like people know you like a lot of people know you well, here's the thing uh, my father has been the face of our house for quite a while other than that I don't really tend to leave the house other than when I went to attend Austin's church he winces when he says this <laughs> But it was useful. I did learn some medical practices from there, so it wasn't all for naught. Does your uh, does your does your father? I can't remember whether we actually heard him say this or not. But does, does your father know that this is the path you're going on to help the rebellion? He will know very shortly. I assume how many days has it been, Sam? Since you since the masquerade. Yeah. And um, yeah. Um, while. I, the wee while. About. That means 20 months. Probably about 20 ish days. He would definitely know that this is the path I'm on. Okay. But it, then I guess that, that, that helps. I'm just. I don't know. I think this is a bit of the rest of my party rubbing off on me, I guess. This could I'm have your. About, I'm worried about you. Help you. I'm worried about you being more appealing to the rebellion as a ransom. Well, I, I can say my. Hmm, I can say my father. It would be desperate to get me back. So if that is the way you can use me, then that would be no, the price. The, Dumbest, that's the no, that's a terrible way to use you. The monkey's okay. like <laughs> magic monkey, magic monkey. Oh. Okay. <sighs> yeah. 
All right. Well. And young Fairfoot, I need to apologize. Uh, when I handed you that bracelet the other day, I didn't mean to cause worry. I know you have a lot on your plate already with the well, whole rebellion. I didn't mean to cause fear or doubt. No, it was Colleen. Colleen smart. It's it's the ideal way, you know. It means you're gonna have someone who you can have at least one of us is gonna have some some trust in you. Mm. So. And I definitely so. wouldn't be would like to be on the wrong side of the Farringham household, especially not. Colleen's father. He's no. quite a wrath in the no. business relationships. But I to be honest, at this stage, if if you would if you would ups if you if you would upset Colleen, like as long as you hadn't harmed her, if you'd upset Colleen or annoyed Colleen or mm. like that would probably just put you in his good books, um right now. Was... Hmm. I don't believe so. Far the Farringham the Mr. Farringham has as I see, a love, a ferocious love for his daughter. I don't know them personally. You probably know them way more than I do, but just the way I see it. But and you're most likely correct. When when he bothers to spend any time with her, then I mm. guess so. <laughs> yes. Yeah. All right, but um, anyway, um, I'll you hand can somewhat back. relate I'll to I'll your young friend. The, uh, the eye patch. Thank you. And I'll I'll see you I'll see you in the morning. See you in the morning. Um, Thank sort of you. Ex exit the room and just here in the corridor. It's like to, ow! I I know I know I know. It's like off in the corner and the monkey's just like. <laughs> uh, also, the monkey is looking like this. <laughs> oh, he's like oh right. It's like, it's like oh no, it's not. Even and then we, when you get back, when you get back to your room, <laughs> Diana is outside like this. <laughs> I, yeah, I no, I'm sorry, I shouldn't have given that away. It just no. out. It's the most sorry. important thing for the sorry. rebellion. <laughs> yeah. Very important. The most important thing to me. The most important thing to the rebellion. No one else knows that we're going there. And now oh. a human noble who we don't know we could trust. Now knows we're going there. Yeah, and he's in a cell with us. And... Now we gotta kill him. I mean, he's gonna. <laughs> no, we. No, we don't. <laughs> don't, don't mean that. <laughs> Ugh. Don't know. Ed, we don't like. We don't know yes, anything. Yeah, we don't know. We don't know enough to tr to trust him yet. But we don't know enough. But it's certainly enough to. To not automatically want to just tip him it overboard. It depends. We can't trust him. I... Th then, like we keep it, we keep him in the cell every night until we reach where we're going, where he would then discover that we're at the winding paths. Um, uh, not if he was in the cell and we left him there. But he's been helping out on deck. And... Yeah, so he's been scrubbing some decks. This doesn't mean that we can trust him with the uh, information that we're going to find, hopefully. Okay. Well, he said he thought we might be going there anyway, so. Yeah, that's fine then. I, I get, I get. The need to 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 be this suspicious around people with do with you the though most wanted. yeah I do but I also get that we're gonna need people like him to no. succeed well we don't no we if don't we have people, if we have people if his intention like if his intentions are true mm -hmm. we we're gonna need people like him which we Otherwise, don't know it is we're just it will stop so much death if we can get through to the people that are in. Look at look look at Colleen. There 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 are people like her all throughout the empire. There are people like her who are being put into the army and thrown against us. We've probably killed people 
that don't even believe in what's happening. It's just like like me, they've grown up in this world thinking I'm this thing and I so I've got to push this thing down to survive no matter how wrong it feels. I know that makes them guilty, but they also don't know that that there's a better world that they can actually achieve. We start achieve we start getting that through. We're starting to do it with Ben Alicia knows so much that they're the Empire's scared that we're gonna get our message out. If he kills us before I get to see my mother, I swear to God, do we? <sighs> he won't. He's got to get past me and taxes and Zeke and Garrick. And... Or stops us from going there at all. Or when we get there, has bad intentions and then does something. We can't trust him. Well, it's a good job, everyone. Anakin. It's a good job you guys are all watching him like a hawk. And you should be. You should well, be. You should be on the same page as everybody else. Well, one of us has got to be optimistic. I was optimistic about seeing my mother again. And you're going to. I hope so. That's going to be interesting. They're going to rescue her from wherever he is. <laughs> I don't quite understand, but if we can survive, I just goes glassy eyed like where where we've just been. Then I swear to Tuna, go. I hope you're right, and he is not going to ruin this. No. He won't. For the first time, I'm sorry, I'm being selfish, so I'm this close. <laughs> okay, so. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm sorry that I said the thing, but we're. Sam, how many days away are we? Um, you are, you've just had one full day of travel, uh, at the, it's like full day of travel day one, at the end of travel day three, about sunset then you're expecting to be there. So a full day tomorrow, and then the day after that, in the evening, you'd expect to be there. Even, even if he is somehow able to get word out, like, it just means we'd, we'd have less time to to get out of there because where we go into is, isn't exactly a hot spot for the army it's ruins we don't know how he communicates we don't know what he can do we don't know anything about him we leave him in the boat when we're there um, I assume Blake's gonna go but yeah maybe Right. Um, I'm sorry I said the thing, but I'm not. I'm not sorry about being optimistic. You know, be you, it's fine you, to be optimistic. That's why. That's 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 you, and that's great. But I don't want you to say anything else to him. Okay. Please. A. <laughs> Sorry, he looks at the floor and he well, like scuffs, scuffs, scuffs his, his foot. His <laughs> hair and just pushes his head. Go to bed. Yeah. <laughs> no way, I'll give him a hug. <laughs> <laughs> you he turns to go in. He's like, oh. <laughs> Pull back in for the hug. Oh, fuck, I can't make it. Yeah. <laughs> um, <sighs> this night uh, is not young, but it's not yet over. 
But for this evening of play, we are going to call our session there. Much still to happen this night, potentially. Uh, many conversations in the dark. Um, I got a chess game to win. Chess game to win. Um, but uh, we free. will pick this up <laughs> next time. Um, thank you all for staying with us. I know it is late. Thank you. Um, uh, but um, yeah, good, good session. Thank you, Sam. That's that okay. We got a new friend, probably, but we got a new friend. Oh my god. Uh... We're, we're building there, we're building there. No, I wouldn't say friend, okay? We have a new per human. We'll go generic. We've got generic. a new friend. Friends, <laughs> mysteries to solve. Like I said, new <clears> colleagues, <throat> maybe, hopefully, in the future. Friends, maybe after all this is a over. A useful tool. A useful tool. Yeah, that also works too. Tool. Um, mad uh, uh, words. <laughs> what we got um to tell people about um on your fumble folks. <laughs> right. Um, while 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 Bree's uh, figuring out who we're gonna raid and everything else. I'm really sorry. I uh, clearly it's have like, uh, used it. I can. I just haven't no, used okay. uh, this fucking keyboard for ages i'm, I'm doing uh, mac stuff um uh, so we we are fumble folks uh, we are fumble folks everywhere um if you are interested in any of the things that we write we have four adventures that are out the one two and three beginners bundle as well as our still apparently selling christmas gift giver game that uh we have just sold yet another one of um <laughs> For some that, that, was, that was amazing. I'm gonna have to put a nice little thank you note in it saying "Merry Christmas." <laughs> uh, as we used earlier, we have two D100 tables that will soon be up on our Patreon. Uh, that is, is exclusive for our Patreon peoples. Or if you see us in cons, you will be able to purchase them. Uh, speaking of which we are pretty much well on our way for our next project which is the witch book and ritual kickstarter we are probably within the last two to three weeks of writing and editing and all of that goodness 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 and then it will be over to Bree to make it not look like waffle um which then waffles, <laughs> waffles. Uh, hopefully, should everything go as according to plan, we will get the copies out by the end of quarter two of this year. Which means the end of July, guys, we got plenty of time. <laughs> what? June. June. May. June. May. Yeah, by the latest, I know. I'm saying for the people who get them delivered to America and it takes them however long the, the international shipping takes. <laughs> Anywho, yeah, who are we sure. going to be waiting for tonight? Uh, we're going to go to see uh, Zombie Malin. No, hey. so what, what are they doing? Um, phobia. Yeah, phasmophobia. What's his name? There's been an advert for me for the last four minutes, so fuck knows. Nice. Uh, <laughs> They're look, currently looking at a toilet um, to see nice. if there's ghosts in it, I guess. They're looking for <laughs> dirty water. It's one of the things they need to take a picture of to get extra points and money. I, oh. think well, well, it's, I know oh, where it is. making me feel sick just watching it, so I would be watching. <laughs> 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 um, but yeah, we'll be going over there now. Now in a minute. Now in a minute. minute. Now in a minute. minute. Whose coat is that jacket? Exactly. Don't know. No star. <laughs> no star. <laughs> yeah. No star, everyone. Yeah, no star, yeah. everybody. Thanks Thank for you, watching, everybody. See you soon. Bye. Bye. Barbarian, but all we've won is to be equalitarian. Who we will rock, who we will never stop. Standing on the top of the hilltop, and we will mock 
viciously, capriciously. We're tired of assault and the bigotry. You seem so full of wit and chivalry. But when we knock at your door, you'll break. We're done. We have fire in our veins and we will break these chains. We're done. We won't be ripped apart. You will be burning battles. Tired of assault and bigotry We'll stand and mock you viciously Through music we captivate Through songs and words we propagate We'll mock and smear and slander Infiltration, propaganda After years is finally resolution It's time to start the revolution We're done! We will rise like the sun and we'll never run And we will fight, fight till we won We will bite, we will smite all through the night We'll never sleep, never rest Put the faith to the test, the self-obsessed Self-confessed, self-professed Divinity, nobility Your God is a fraud, so stop We're done With the violence and the fury and the cruelty Said we're done. We will win the war. We'll win the fight. The end's inside. All you see in us is barbarian. But all we want is to be equalitarian. And we will rock. We will never stop. Standing on the top of the hilltop. And we will mock. Viciously, capriciously, we're tired of assault and the bigotry. You seem so full of wit and chivalry, but when we knock at your door, you'll break. We're done. We have fire in our veins and we will break these chains. We're done. We won't be ripped apart. You will be burning battles. Tired of salt and bigotry, we'll stand and mock you viciously. Through music we captivate, through songs and words we propagate. We'll mock and smear and slander, infiltration, propaganda. After years is finally resolution, it's time to start the revolution. We're done. We will rise like the sun and we'll never run And we will fight, fight till we won We will bite, we will smite all through the night We'll never sleep, never rest Put the faith to the test, the self-obsessed Self-confessed, self-professed Divinity, nobility Your God is a fraud, so stop We're done With the violence and the fury and the cruelty Said we're done. We will win the war. We'll win the fight. The end's inside. 
all you see in us is barbarian but all we want is to be equalitarian and we will rock we will never stop standing on the top of the hilltop and we will mock viciously capriciously we're tired of assault and the bigotry you seem so full of wit and chivalry but when we knock at your door you'll break we're done we have fire in our veins and we will break these chains